Message to the Gremlins. Let's go. This is Boy Dinner episode, I don't know, 21? Let's go. We got Brennan. We got Jess. We got Ben. We got me. It's a good episode, folks. Welcome. Let's go, dude. <laughs> How's everyone doing? Brennan? Good. Doing good? good. I feel like I'm, as Rob Barr said, I'm doing something correct if I'm here for the third week. Oh, you know? shoot. So, third week okay. in a row? I think so, right? Because we... Actually well, is. Yeah. So, feels Man, good. Yeah. Freaking... Bro's just... He's a veteran dude, now. You're yeah, that, I'm you're perfect. Vet. You know? Yeah. Nothing yeah. wrong. He just yeah. walks around with like a microphone just floating yeah. in front of him at all times. Yeah. Yeah. Just, just practicing. Just, how are you? I feel good. First feel time. Good. Okay. Okay. Yep. Popping my cherry. Yeah. 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 That's <laughs> crazy. That's <laughs> <what I'm saying. laughs> nice no, I'm excited. I'm excited. No, no, no. It'll be good. It's fun. Ben Schiffman. Second time. Let's go. A charm. Okay. Well, okay. Third time's a charm normally, but. Nah, dude, you're a charm. I'm. I haven't popped my cherry yet, so. <laughs> <laughs> Let me help. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, I'm. I'm feeling pretty good. Okay. Honestly. You get on this thing and you feel really nervous, mm. and then you just start winging it. You just start flow, winging it. Yeah, that and then state. you start saying it's the same stuff. Yeah. yeah. You feeling healthy? No. No? No. <laughs> no, he yeah. hasn't started his uh, protein journey yeah. yet. Yeah. The, tell, yeah. Tell us about yeah, the, tell us about that. The diet here. All right. So, this is an idea. Of this that. is an idea of mine I was mentioning earlier, was because I did the carnivore diet for 30 days, and I had terrible like diet. Like, you ate raw butter. <laughs> right? That, like that's what they do in the carnivore diet. Well, like they that's, they eat meat though. You can. You, wait, 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 like with like your I, would, wait, 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 wait. I see ladies like eat um butter. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, that's, that's no, you don't have to do that. that. Yeah, yeah, you oh, can. Like, yeah. Do you think the carnivore diet was just people eating no, butter all like, the time? No, like every time I see the carnivore diet, they're like, okay, I had giant steak and a stick of butter. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, I mean I did do that. She's saying in addition. Yeah, yeah. Oh well, I never like. I wasn't eating it like in a crazy dish. I was just cooking it with a little bit of butter. Okay, anyway, okay but, if, but if you're cu- if you're cooking with it though, you're telling me you're not gonna cut off a little. Oh no, I do. I do. Yeah, I do. Little snacky food. Yeah, I do. You guys do that? No, when I was on carnivore, I was doing it. Okay, but not anymore. I'm not a psychopath like these guys. You're not. But, what are you cooking? Bro, I'm trying to cut right now. Yeah, but like, what so do what you, you cook? Yeah, what do you use? Mm-hmm. Oh, you just don't use anything. Mm-hmm. Not right now. Mm. You, for for what do you want? for chick for chicken and everything? Yeah, just air fry it. Oh, okay, okay, that's okay, good. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, wait. That's you good. Were saying, you okay, okay. So I did carnivore. I felt like trash mm. for a month, mm. and then I lost a bunch of weight. Lost fifteen pounds, but I went from one sixty nine to like yeah. I can't do math right now, but um, so I freaking I actually can't. I don't even know okay. what it is. But uh, it's not a math podcast. Yeah, right? Yeah. you're right, 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 right. But I um yeah, I lost fifteen pounds, and then I was like felt like crap but now I'm, I'm like a king of challenges i like to do like little mm-hmm. little oh. challenges so he asked me like i did i ran three miles every day for 30 days and then i just started doing that routinely so i don't think this next thing i'll do routinely but i want to do <laughs> i saw a video of a guy who ate like protein bars only like <laughs> protein shakes only <laughs> for, just only for process. 30 days <laughs> and he like the guy got ripped and he just did the same things i was doing your yeah. farts are gonna be lethal my farts yeah. were okay. No, my farts were just shits when I was on car. But, uh, <laughs> they were just liquid. Literally, liquid, 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 liquid is bad. But I, they were I don't something think my, to clean up. I don't think my farts would be that lethal because, like, if in theory, like the accessibility part is like the, the good part about this because, like, yeah, oh, you just whip out a protein bar, right? Like every freaking two hours. Better yet, there's something else you can whip. No. There, there's a better, <laughs> there's a better challenge. I think you should do not eating for thirty days. The gallon of milk a day. Oh, oh dude, that is that just makes me sick. No, no, no. I'd rather I would wait, wait. So that's the only thing I eat mm. because that's a lot of calories, right? It is. How many? How many calories is that? I feel like you could just do a gallon of milk a day. Yeah, but you probably say, wouldn't. That's so much dairy, though. Like, but that's, how many calories? I, that would be if you're lactose intolerant, that, bro, I am that lactose can, intolerant. Okay, yeah, so you'd be fucked. I think it would really hurt <laughs> me. But uh, twenty four hundred calories in a gallon. Of so milk. you literally yeah. could do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, the thing is, I'd worry about with that is that. All the liquid from that, I would be like, oh, I don't need water. And I'd be super dehydrated because I'd be like liquided out, right? I don't know if you would be dehydrated. Has anyone tried this before? Is that, or is that just something you It's a up? thing. All right. It's an actual thing. Yeah. The gallon of milk. It'd have challenge. to be like raw milk because I feel like regular milk isn't – it's too processed to get everything out of it. <laughs> Make me thirsty. Yeah, I don't know. But, um, but with the 
protein shakes i feel like that would be much worse <laughs> well i don't i'm not even really thinking about shakes more so uh, uh bars bar, because, just bar, like what like, about like powder like would you make would you make, make my your own, own shake yeah. with like a like fruit no no fruit no fruit Dude, well I, just like water is mixed with water milk i would or just be freaking i would want to like intentionally like oh. be eating processed stuff just Dude. to like that's crazy. It's like Bear Grylls. No, that's criminal. In the modern <laughs> like day. Bear, oh. Bear Grylls. Yeah, Bear Grylls is this processed protein I'm bar. Yeah, basically. Like, I love that. Look, the, what I found, look what I found in this tree, a nice protein I'm the bar. Processed, <laughs> I'm, the pro, I'm the processed Bear Grylls. Okay. Mm, that's what they say. Okay. Yeah. So instead of being that's in, what they say. In, in the wild, I'm just in the grocery store. Yeah, that's your wild. Protein it's just bars. the, the, yeah. it's like, the God, processed I gotta, food it's like, section. I got to get out of here. And then here I get, it's like, I got to get out of this grocery store. I got to eat five protein bars before Dude, I leave. That's going to be you on the toilet. You'd be like, I've got to get out of here. Right? Yeah, yeah, I've yeah. been sitting on this yeah. bowl for eight days in a row. No, no, no he should low-key right? document this. He's like, British. I don't know. I think. I want to see this. Something. You should do a little YouTube. Yeah. yeah. Like a little yeah. series. A little series? Yeah. I don't know how my viral my series would go. I don't Bro, know. That's, yeah. yeah. That's, <laughs> yeah why, that's why you got to start. Yeah. So that's why you got to start now. Dude, I, that's the one thing I've wondered. Uh, I, I have that dilemma of whether or not I'm doing something like if it's like taking videos of stuff, mm. if they're to, to post it or mm. if it's to actually enjoy it. Because I don't really mm. enjoy having pictures on my phone. I mm. like them to be physical. You know, like what I have the, like okay. printed out pictures, which are yeah. like cool, but I don't mm. take pictures just all the time. Mm. I think the best example of that is the people that either take photos or video of fireworks. Yes. You will never, yeah, ever yeah, look no. back at that. I don't no. do, I don't do that. Cause I yeah. also, that's, that's when I start, I'm like, I'm like, this is too far gone. My yeah, mom will just, be like, should we? Get a video of that firework. That shit was huge. <laughs> that was I'm like, funny. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like you mean, which then, one? I'm like the one that just. And, I'm then like, you, and then you, yeah, you look at it, and it's not even amusing, and it's like just, I don't even go on Instagram or Snapchat yeah. on the Fourth of July. It's like, like it's all just. Fireworks. If you went to like, I don't know, like if it was like the Chinese New Year, and there was like a bunch of like things floating around, mm-hmm. like I'd be like, oh, that's super sick. Yeah, but like, it's during the Fourth of July. There's just like. Uh, and during New Year's, there's just regular fireworks. Yeah. Yeah. They're not even the illegal South Carolina ones. And you can't tell if it's fireworks or gunshots when you're yeah. going to bed. Depends. Early, like depends on where, which, which city or, or yeah. location. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It also depends if it echoes or not. That's true. Ooh. That's true. Oh, that's a good point. I never thought about fireworks. That. Are really cool though. Like I think that like like as something that could happen like, per, that happens pretty consistently. It's cool to see, but I would never mm. like take no. a video of it. I don't think that's. That's like in the uh, background of a picture that would be like yeah, if you had a picture yeah. with people and there was a firework in the background going off. It's, it's pretty cool. It's got to be pretty fun to do the whole light it and run sort of thing. Mm-hmm. You know what I Have mean? Have you done it before? No. Really? No. It's fun. Do a little put in reverse, Terry. Oh, really? yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Terry. yeah. No, it's yeah, it's Terry's definitely crazy. it's definitely fun. Like setting off fireworks is a, it's a cool yeah, cool yeah. experience. Okay, so back to the diet thing. Pro- yeah, full don't. processed foods for you. What's you said you're cutting? What's the cut looking like? How oh how are God. we how are we going about this? Yeah. Bad. Bad. It's bad? So Why? Bad, guys. Why is it bad? Is it like a results based thing or? It's both. It's mm. like I am hungry all mm. the oh, time. Yeah. And I'm not. I'm underperforming in the gym, and I feel like I'm losing my muscles. Yeah. Strength wise, or both. I mean, what are you typically training? Um, like my split. Yeah. Mm. Or is it like more strength focus, more hypertrophy? It's more sh- like strength, progressive okay. overload. Mm, okay. Like I'm just constantly trying to get higher reps and higher weight. Okay. Um, but the cut's bad. Like bad. I am probably eating, or I try to eat like 1,400 to 1,500 calories a day. No way. Have Is you that- tried switch? Sorry. Have you tried switching like your workout phase, like from strength more towards bodybuilding? That's what I did because mm. my all my comp movements went down. I so. know I should, but I'm an ego lifter. <laughs> <laughs> hey, she admits it though. Yeah, admittedly, it's yeah. fire. What What is your diet? You were just eating <clears throat> beef. You don't know his diet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you don't oh, know. Bro's the don't same. Know his diet? Literally the crazy? same. His diet is, everything is, is pretty. The same. It's that if you want to talk about someone eating like everything the same every day. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. He's really the only yeah. person that doesn't need to track their food because he eats yeah. the same. Yeah. Literally the same thing every day. I've, I've been doing basically no ultra processed foods for like seven ish years i mean since freshman year of high school i think around then is when i started meal prepping Mm -hmm. i'd bring my meals to school do all that kind of stuff uh 
there was kind of an evolution of knowledge from that point to maybe five, six years ago where I kind of actually understood. Because I would be looking at nutrition facts all the time. And I'd be like, oh, 32 carbs, yeah, that's probably pretty good. And I'm like, what? I don't even know what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. I, I would just be guessing based on some numbers. And then now I don't, I do not care at all about the nutrition facts. It's just ingredients. Mm-hmm. Um, everything I eat is just a single ingredient, mm-hmm. basically. So I do beef, uh, fruit, mm-hmm. dairy, honey, orange juice. That's it. You're like the triangle that we eat. Yeah, he's a little, di- he's a, di- a little different. <laughs> it's a bit different. I don't yeah. think not many greens, right? No, I don't. There's, I mean, there's an idea about vegetables, which I don't necessarily buy into or not buy into. Mm-hmm. It was more so uh, popularized by Paul Saladino. He was a carnivore guy. Mm-hmm. Now he's an animal-based guy, so he does what I do, where it's meat, fruit, raw dairy, uh, and honey. I do rice. Goat's milk kefir. Right. So the rice would be the only thing not considered that. Trying to gain weight, doing all those things. Rice isn't like bad necessarily. It's more of just kind of a neutral. Um, So I do that. But the thought about the whole vegetables thing is that a plant grows, it produces fruit. The plant wants the fruit to be eaten. So it spreads its seed through animals, eating it, crabbing, Mm -hmm. whatever, grows more of the plant. And then they say as a survival mechanism, it gives off uh, defense chemicals, which they think are bad for the human body, or some people respond really poorly to it. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 That makes sense. It it does. And and in terms of survival, I feel like it makes sense to me. Uh, I'm not super like, oh, the defense chemicals are terrible. I think likely for some people maybe it's really bad for some people it's probably not so crazy of a result i know exactly what you're talking about have you ever heard of um fodmap no you have the fodmap diet i went on it Mm because i had some really bad gut issues for a while i forgot what it stood for but it's essentially that there are certain food groups that release that chemical or Does, chemicals uh, like that that oh. don't sit well with your stomach so what what's in nightshades it's like a very easy digestible diet Mm -hmm. that can that you use if you have gut issues so that it can essentially heal your gut over time because it's not mm. stressful. <laughs> yeah. No, nice. Like, Emoting. Yeah. 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 I did not shit for two weeks. I went to the ER. Really? really? Wait, on the FOD? No, that, that FOD was to help fix that. Because you what's know what's, what's crazy is I had a very similar experience before I went on carnivore. I, I had a – Yeah. I had a – where I like gut it out and then were you like full but you couldn't – you didn't yeah, go to Yeah, I have like – the the scans that they took of my everything and you uh-huh. like and it's because I my thing was I uh, I had a, a gallbladder stone oh yeah dang. yeah that's yeah. painful holy <laughs> it was like, cow yeah so I don't even know how it got they gave me meds okay yeah and I was that's like, terrible yeah I'm no sorry. I was like I was ter- it was it really yeah this oh, is like man. uh four years ago this is a long time jeez dude yeah so I was that's like, brutal I was hurting I was like. Yeah, I was like, my stomach was just killing me. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, what is this called again? The FODMAP. So, FODMAP. So. FODMAP. Fermentable, oligosaccharides, disaccharides, monosaccharides, and polyols. Hey, that's that's not okay. FOD, though. Only FOD was FOD. What were the other things on there? FODMAP. FOD. Fermentable, oligosaccharides, O. D. Disaccharides, monosaccharides, and polyols. So, I guess the AND is A. Mm-hmm. Fod map. Fod map. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Um, m- yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That makes so, sense. Yep. Okay. So, well, yeah. Do I we guess. know what that means? <laughs> it's just. It's exactly what you were talking about. It's okay. just there. There are certain foods that release those chemicals that okay. make it hard for some people to digest. So that's defining what the bad things are. Yeah. Fod-map so when you went on this, it fixed all your. It. It was like a reset. Mm-hmm. It was a nice reset. Ah, uh, yeah. So, I mean, I, there are certain foods that I still avoid because they, like, have, mm-hmm. like have what? reactions. Um, like cabbage, mm. watermelon. I love watermelon. That's what? Really? Wait, yeah. avoiding okay. watermelon? Oh, so, yeah. I thought watermelon was mostly water like mm. and sugar. I thought that was literally it. I mean, it's high FODMAP. So mm. it's, Watermelon's a great pump. I wonder if, uh, this, I wonder if, the, seeds, I wonder if the seeds have something to do with I that. I have no idea. Mm. 
I'm surprised by cabbage though, because cabbage is really good for the gut if it doesn't cause that issue, those issues. Yeah, it's it's so. it's, it's, it's it's honestly it's like very individual. I'm gonna guess. Yeah. So it, was tomatoes individual. was tomatoes on that list? Yeah, I think because so. Because tomato, dude. Okay. That's the big one. Yeah. I yeah. always hear like now, like my dad was like growing up was like tomatoes are the best for you, mm. and I was like, they're on burgers. Like, there's no way they could be good for you. <laughs> I think they're associated but, like, with burgers. Yeah, I well, also I hate the taste of tomatoes. Oh, wow. I've oh, never I like them. I really. Like them. I love tomatoes. Dude, I hate tomatoes. tomatoes. The goop on the inside, I'd fill a cup with that. Oh, Did I? I love it. Okay, uh, okay. No, hey, I, I don't. All right. I don't know if it's I didn't the texture. I was dishonest. I don't think it's the flavor because I like tomato juice. I think it's the. I think it's just the texture of actually. Oh, okay. Tomato. But I um. Like I hate tomatoes, and so when then when like my dad went to the doctor and was like, "Yeah, tomatoes are." The doctor said tomatoes are not good for you, at all. So I, think, I don't I know think like when not, they say that. Uh, yeah, I think it's. Okay. I don't know why. It's very subjective. Like yeah. I don't know why they're not good for you. I've heard, like, the, like the nightshades thing. I've heard that. that. That's what I have up here. So nightshade is a family of plants that include tomatoes, eggplant, potatoes, and peppers. Tobacco is also in the nightshade family. Nightshades are unique. Because they contain a small amount of alkaloids. Alkaloids are chemicals that are mainly found in plants. Let's look up what are alkaloids. What are alkaloids? <clears throat> Any class of nitrogenous organic compounds of plant origin which have pronounced physiological actions on humans. They include many drugs, morphine, uh, guanine? I don't know. Morphine. And poisons. Not a stem mm. girly. Sorry. Can't. So, <laughs> yeah. Not. You said stem girly? Yeah, no. Savage. <laughs> savage? Savage. Who says savage? I say it sarcastically savage. now, but it's kind of fun. Savage. Savage. Bro. It's pretty savage. Okay, what do alkaloids do to human? <clears throat> they showed anti-inflammatory, anti-cancer. This is probably See, this is probably produced by big alkaloid. Look, I don't yeah, know. yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah Any bro, health advice that you look into, you will always find contradictory. It's, it's very, yeah. it's it, very it, subjective. Like it's, it's very, yeah. yeah. No, it's yeah. like it's like oh, the potato diet is terrible for you, and it's like yeah. the potato diet. Yeah, it's, it's, it's good for you. So I was gonna say because I had gut issues like two years ago, mm-hmm. and it was literally salt with cabbage. Really, so I started eating a lot of sauerkraut. Uh-huh. And because I had a problem for like it was getting bad to the point Were where like, I kimchi? had to see someone. Mm-hmm. Really? It was, it was, I've heard kimchi is great. So kimchi is good. Delicious. What worked for me was sauerkraut. Sauerkraut was like the best. It's the probiotics in there. Mm-hmm. Was it? It's a that's, mix of that's, pro- a, that's one thing that gets contradicted uh-huh. too, though. Is like people like love kombucha, kim- yeah. kimchi, sauerkraut. Kombucha doesn't do much. And for then me. it's like now people are like, like some people are like, oh, it's yeah. like terrible for you. And I don't know. I, I don't know because I've okay when I drank kombucha, I was like, oh, I actually like the taste of this. Man, my stomach is killing me. I thought it killed my stomach. It made me bloated. I feel like it's one of those things that a lot of foods take a while to adapt to, though. Because when I first started doing the um, the raw eggs in the smoothie, first couple weeks, I was like, yo. Like, (laughs) you know, I was was going top speed to the bathroom for sure. But after a while, your body gets used to it. But I think that's because those are the foods that are – kind of digging in on the old gut biome and uh you know yeah, yeah. some things up so. well that's the thing with those with those ones like kimchi and kombucha that's like such an industry mm. like com- the kombucha there's like that is true there's like yeah. 10 kombucha makers there's probably like 10 kimchi mm-hmm. makers that are big in the grocery store yeah. and so it's like those got like maybe if you made your own kombucha or made your own yeah. kimchi it's good for you but i don't know if like actually ingesting it from like the brand is good. I think everything yeah. is just individualized. Like yep. everybody has to figure out what works for them and what doesn't. Yeah. I think there are a couple of things that where it's like you have to abide by this to meet your goals. Like the amount of calories, like because the law of thermodynamics, yeah. if you're eating more than you expend, you're going to gain weight. And the opposite, if you want to lose weight, yeah. And yeah, that's true for everyone regardless. Yeah, but in terms of the right foods to eat, and also I think, but protein is also essential for everyone. You have to be getting a certain amount of protein if you want to maintain muscle or gain muscle. But other than that, there's certain types of food to get there. It just depends on the person and your genetics. I, I, yeah. I agree. I think that's the same thing with like um, like if you generally follow that you eat well and you're feeling well, like you're feeling yeah. like you're yeah. you know, yeah. it, feeling like you're eating well. That is true. You're eating you're feel. eating at your at your calorie level and you're mm-hmm. exercising every day. You're not going to be unhealthy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like that's and then and that's like some people think it's like a magic. Mm-hmm. Like me, I don't think I'm in like insane shape, but I know that I I feel pretty good yeah. most of the time. Yeah. So I and I I exercise and I 
eat, I don't really think I eat well, but I eat okay. Okay, so I have a question for everybody. Mm. Like, what's the weirdest food you think you eat? Or, like, weird food combo? Because you said eggs and smoothie, raw eggs. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's kind of... Yeah, I suppose so. I, I do... I mean, I eat raw liver every morning now. That's insane. Oh, oh you, you went yeah. liver? Okay, yeah. let's go. Well, what does it taste like? Metal? It tastes really, 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 really horrible. Really horrible. Yeah. So, but how would you yeah. describe this <laughs> horrible you, taste? What do you do it for? Well, liver is super good for you. It's, it's like the best food. Yeah, like, that, I mean, <laughs> I think the fun example is whenever in the wild an animal kills another They're animal, that's the, the first thing they eat is the liver. Oh, I so, didn't know that. So it's mm-hmm. kind of got Who? that. Wait, uh, it's a, what, what type of liver is it? Like, whose liver is it? Just beef liver? Uh, well, Doug brought me some from a guy that he, I don't know, I think he's like sponsored by a certain farm or something. And he just like. It's it like what, what animal? Is it oh, like, cow. Oh, it's like cow. Beef cow liver. liver. Yeah, it's beef yeah. liver. Okay. But what I did. Beef liver? Yeah. So when he first brought it over, we cut it up and maybe like a quarter size piece each raw. Mm-hmm just ate it and it wasn't like oh swallow it real quick and then just whatever we were like you know gave it mm. a taste it oh, was God, dude. murder oh, it was really bad there's so much stuff in liver that's probably why it just like how so, like what how would you describe the taste yeah is it anything comparable to anything or no no it i mean if you taste it it makes sense genuinely it, it's i want to try it i mean I you should try it yeah now. yeah you definitely can have some. <laughs> yeah, it's it's so bitter in the weirdest way. Mm. You're you're just it's so hard to. Have explain. you tried cooking it? I have. Or do you cook it when you eat it now or no? No. So I I froze it. I cut it up into a bunch of slices, froze it, and now I just cut it up into tiny little pieces. So I take like a you know mm. like silver dollar size. Mm-hmm. Uh, chunk, cut it into little pieces, and then swallow it with my smoothie. So mm. I don't it's like taste it. It's like a pill, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, you should there, try there are liver pills too. Right? Yeah, there, there are. are. There yeah, are. Yeah. Pills. It's like desiccated. But liver. is that does that work as well? Probably not, right? It's probably not as bioavailable because it doesn't. It's not the actual pure form. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, but um, no. So it was myself, my friend Doug, Frank, and then Paul. Uh, we all ate it at the same time. Mind you, Paul had changed the trash out beforehand. He put a new bag in. He's like, just in case anybody throws up, I'm talking in, chew for about five seconds, turn around. Paul's just, what? Like oh, screaming, sh- vomiting oh, in the that's trash. Crazy. I've seen the video. It's, it, it's great. Oh, it was when a you, video? When he descri- yeah, when oh, he des- I'll try to find yeah, it. When he, describes, when, he, watch when he described it right there, I was thinking about the video of him throwing up. It's like a gross video. Like, hey, man, it's uh, that's crazy. No, like, I want to try it. <laughs> I, I so you, you want to throw up? No, nah, I don't know. I, nah, I, 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 I don't think you will. I don't think you will. Either. I mean, the main thing that had me queasy thinking about throwing up was seeing Paul. my friends. Yeah, throwing yeah that's up. what I saw. When I saw okay. You said it was only like a yeah I well mean, that's no wait, 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 wait. <laughs> was that the, that was the quarter size that he had then, or that, that's just what you have? Let's watch. Oh, no, I mean. He's not a very appealing. Get your, get your liver. This oh, is wait, so whoa, funny. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I'm not getting that one. Yeah, you are. Oh, that's so nice. Oof. We can cut off another one if you need to. Oh, it's hard, it's hard to grab. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, just nice. Right. Bro, you got to try yes. heart next yes. time. Yes. Are we doing this? Oh, yes, sir. Right. Cheers in? Cheers in. Cheers, boys. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mmm. 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 All right, all right. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> no way. <laughs> He threw up oh. really fast, too. Fuck. <laughs> he goes, oh, you're getting killed today, Paul. You're getting roasted. <laughs> He's getting roasted. I was like, dude, crying. that's crazy. Oh, my. oh man. Paul, I want to cook Paul, it up I, and try I to, like, ate one of your Oikos Greek yogurts. Yeah. yeah. Salt, pepper, I don't know. Some that's, garlic. Yeah, no, that's what I was going to say is when I first had liver, it was cooked. Uh, my friend Greer, he made some... Just salted the heck out of it, made it kind of like a steak or did whatever. Did it just taste like salt, or did you still taste the actual? Dude, it tasted so fine. Because um, my other friend tried so it. So fine. Is- we were, we all three tried the liver, and I hadn't tried it for big, so I was on the phone. And my friend Caleb tried it, and he's like, uh, it was so bad, dude. He's like, it was, it was really bad. I was like, 
Really? That, that doesn't sound... I mean, I can't imagine it being that bad. I tried it. It was just like a different kind of beef. Mm. Mm. Right. Have you thought about putting it in with your own beef? Just like a couple pieces? So some uh, beef brands out there have like a, oh. a renegade blend. Oh, oh. shit, dude. Where it's ground beef and, and whatever else. Oh. And... Uh, new new partner beef partner situation dude let's fucking go this I, is sick. I asked them about it and they're about to have a uh like a venison version of okay. that with oh, one of their yummy. suppliers okay, okay. that sounds so good yeah it's it's insane it's exciting let's so go. i'm so excited for you thanks bro thanks brother thanks <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? they had a moment yeah we had a we had you a know, not the moment first there. So, yeah, true. but the diet right now, did you yeah. say what your diet now is consisting of? Or is it still just kind of following that sort of thing? Like what? What's, like, your, what main, do you what's your main protein? Yeah. yeah, like what are you eating today? You don't, you don't do that, uh, the FMOL or whatever. No, uh, I don't do FODMAPs anymore. <laughs> the FML, FML diet? No. <laughs> Fuck my lifetime. <laughs> no, I, so I'm trying to get like 150 grams of protein today. That's good. Um, okay. cause that's my goal weight okay. pretty much. Um, I eat oatmeal every day. Okay. I put egg whites in it, protein powder. Okay. Oatmeal is good. Sometimes I chuck some uh, canned tuna in there. Whoa. Whoa. That's risky Damn. biscuit. Yeah. Right. Right. Okay, that, yeah. That, okay, wait. That's you're, high that's, you, Your original question was the grossest yeah. thing you eat? A hundred percent. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's that's disgusting. what it was. That's what this yeah. was leading. To. Right. That's yeah. right. You're, that's, it's, yeah. yeah. You're a terrible person. Yeah. It's, <laughs> really, good. it's really good. It's really good. Like you get. Anyway, so I eat oatmeal. <laughs> no. I eat oatmeal pretty much every day. Okay. Um, I used to eat a lot of non-fat Greek yogurt, but I think it's contributing to my acne. Okay. Mm. So I kind of stopped because of the while. dairy. Yeah, mm. I don't know. I'm just trying to figure that out. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then I just eat like a lot of chicken. Okay. 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 Why not and beef? Then, mm-hmm. Um, just because of the calorie content. Mm. Like my goal right now mm. is to cut calories. Interesting. Okay. Beef is delicious. Yeah. I love it. Even the ninety-three-seven beef. Is it still above the threshold? Oh, well, it's also expensive. Like the it is. The yeah, lean. chicken breast. I'll, pu- I'll push back. If you go to Sam's Club, oh, four ninety eight a pound, bro. Th- that's eighty five fifteen though. They didn't have ninety three seven. They have oh. they, they do they have ninety three oh, seven. It's not the grass fed, but they got it. Mm. Yeah. I'm not a Sam's girl. I'm a Costco girly. Mm. So they probably have it there. Costco they have got- it. They have it there, but yeah, I buy well, like. Do you you have a Costco buy, membership? Mm-hmm, I buy like the chicken breast that comes in like you have a co- show us your costco yeah. card oh it's in my car yeah, prove it. Come on. yeah i, don't I would it. what's your membership number? Yeah, yeah please can i get a photo of the bar you know the thing is i've never belonged <laughs> i just take my card you okay. can go you can, or i'll take you, you guys well I, I, i'm a uh, no. i'm like banned from those stores why, no, why are you no i'm not my mom just never like my parents never got costco oh. stuff mm. or like sam my parents were not in Costco, Sam Claus. I got it BJ, a year ago. BJ's. Yeah. I I went in there with my cousins and I was like je- like jealous. Mm. I was like, this is so awesome. No worries. Yeah. Man. Okay. Their, so. their hot dogs are good. I'm sorry. I've never had a hot dog in my life. Really? That's wild. In your life? Even before, like you never. Right? Had, you said you never had cereal, right? Or no? You had. I, I had an egg for the first time like two years ago. He was. He grew up in a cave. Bro went from cereal to eggs. Like I just oh. always thought they smelled <laughs> so horrible. Eggs, you know, I hate. I'm gonna be honest. Eggs, like I have an issue with eggs sometimes. See, the only eggs that I do now would be uh, like a fried egg, mm-hmm. and I do it pretty. I get some brown on the bottom, like I make mm-hmm. it crispy, which I enjoy. Yeah, but yeah. I like that. Sound I mean, too. like a freaking. What's the one where you break it off around and hard boiled? You know, you break it off, dude. So, I, I would, I would throw so, up for distance. Here's the, I, I here's the thing. Here's the thing. I, bro, I like boiled. I love, I, 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 I love, love hard boiled eggs. eggs. Okay, wait, wait. wait. I like, I, I like I, the eggs. one combo at a time. The mic's full. Cool. Oh. <laughs> I love hard boiled eggs. Okay. I don't yeah, know. I love hard boiled eggs, but I hate sunny side up. Ooh, the best. kind. That's like the one that's the running yolk. Yeah, running yolk. When the yolk runs out. Like, the it's like then it's you like dip wet. your bread okay. into it, dude. Oh, that's, that's yeah. disgusting. You're gross. Yeah, that's gross to me. See, but I like the fried. I like the fried go. way better. That's like probably my favorite okay. style of egg. But see, I, I cook it for long enough where the, the yolk crazy turns hard, basically. So it can't even be runny, mm. even if I want it. Yeah, that's to. what I like. I like that style. But see, I... I start it, and then once it kind of... Uh, once it cooks for a few minutes, I break the yolk. 
and spread oh, it around. And spread, yeah. So then it's not these friggin' chalk balls of yeah. nasty egg yolk. That's disgusting. I like to have it spread around. I just like scrambled eggs with cheese. I've never. Yeah, that's the not, best. Not that kind of guy. My sister used to like scrambled eggs with ketchup. Uh, Ketchup's yeah. fine. I, I, I fine. was like very opposed to that. Mm. I'm like a human. I'm like a garbage disposal. I will intake almost anything. Okay. <laughs> nice. I love okay. it. You yeah. have a lot of respect for yourself. Let's go. You? <laughs> the sound effects. Yeah. <laughs> so how many eggs are we eating daily? I know you eat like six. what six. Yeah. Zero for me. I haven't Zero. had an egg in, in weeks. And I don't eat eggs. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. I'd say a couple a week, but I eat egg whites every day. Oh, okay. okay. So, no, you ever just drink them? I haven't gotten to that point yet. Ugh. That's what Mike was doing. He, he, That's bro, just nasty. Bro. It's gross. No. That's gross. Not catch me eating and drinking an egg. Mm, four or five. Okay. Uh, a day? Oh. Whoa. 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 Heart healthy, man. Cholesterol. <laughs> bro said six, and I'm getting, <laughs> I'm getting pounded. Hey, look at that. Hey, <laughs> wait, did you say six? <laughs> mm-hmm. I don't, I th- wait, I yeah, I went over my head too. I thought you were, I honestly maybe thought it was like six, I don't know, Teen. a week. Yeah, <laughs> six. Or not. Yeah, praise week. me. What the heck? Oh, no, I, I was just talking to you for Batman earlier. <laughs> yeah, bro. I, we just got, you know. So it's okay. Yeah, we need to. Okay. Yeah, I want to come play bad. Dude, two's right Please. here. We got. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah, this is a this is a doubles right yeah. here. Actually, hand eye coordination is so bad because this eye. Mm-hmm. Dude, you have doesn't a lot work. Of problems, really? Yeah, my brain, <laughs> my brain turns it off. No, wait, no, no, no. you're just telling yourself that. Yeah, just yourself. yeah. you just gotta. Believe. Wait, wait, are you? Do you actually That's think you have some sort of condition? No, I have astigmatism. Oh, like it's it's clinical lazy eye. Oh. Really? But like you don't, your eye doesn't look lazy. Not yet. That's a blessing. It's going to become Probably. lazy? No. No. Just work it out. Do yeah. our contacts. <laughs> well, I wear yeah. glasses usually. Just work it out. It will become but lazy. But like I need to start patching again because I used to patch and I just walk around you, like this. You know, wait, patch? Which is good because I have an obsession with pirates. Okay. Mm. I love pirates. Should I'm sorry. You. Who's your favorite pirate? Yeah. Blackbeard. Oh, is that the no. only pirate you can name? No, my family is from Bath. <laughs> Bath, North Carolina. That's oh, okay. where he lives. Have you been to Blackbeard's house in, uh, like, uh, Beaufort? Or his... Uh, his plot? I think it's his plot. I don't his know. plot of land, yeah. yeah. That's where his buried treasure is. Yeah, yeah, Oh, yeah, shit. Yeah. Okay. I thought he'd be on a boat. <laughs> no, the boat The boat sunk. sunk. Yeah. Queen Anne's Revenge. Whoa. I know too much. You know about, some I know too stuff. much about Blackbeard. Okay, okay. My dad okay. used to dive, like, onto... Yeah, yeah. The guy who ran that? Was my dad's roommate in college, and he got diving or yeah, whatever? and he got arrested a year ago for child pornography. Really? What? That's Dude, that, my dad was best friends with that guy. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> no, but they worked together. Really? Your, yeah, your dad? Did? That, no, no, no. Your dad that, had that guy. Oh, okay, okay. That guy that your dad your dad worked with that guy, and my dad, dad just knew him. Really? Wow. Child pornography, bro. Never trust anybody. No, that's horrendous. true. Don't trust anybody. Yeah, you don't want to see that. Dude, no, that's uh, that's that's. We went from pirates to yeah. <laughs> Somehow your dad has yeah. something to do. Whatever. With this. No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. My dad has nothing to do with that. Nothing. Was your dad a pirate? No, my dad loves golf. Let's go. Dude, hey. All right. Golf, should, golf, golf and should, badminton. Should we call him out? <laughs> we were supposed to go golfing today. Yeah. We need to. We need to pick on. Play our... nine or eighteen. Probably, Probably nine. 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 Wait, wait. Nine. Yeah, nine, nine, nine. Yeah, what? I think those co- that course is small though. Yeah. Yeah. Lonnie Pool? No. Nice play. Nice play. You play Lonnie Pool? I know. I live. Do I you live, golf a lot? I did. I really? grew up going to golf camp every Dude, summer. Dude, you could no have way. Way. This could have been our foursome today. Man. We literally, true. we could have. Would you have played I, today? I would have played. I'm not good. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. god All right. Well. All right. Next. Now we gotta establish. Zoom, this. Yeah. Do you guys know Wildwood? Yes. yes. I played Wildwood. Yep. So I, I used to play North. Oh, you there? I used yeah, to play Northridge, like Oaks and Lakes. Oh, but then I yeah. stopped. Then I I stopped playing golf from my freshman year of high school until like whenever we played mm. like two years ago. Oh, yeah, that's a long no, day. and I, I like I completely lost it. Really? Yeah. Well, that's what happens if you're not sticking with golf. You lose that shit so quick. See, it's, it's so technical. Yeah, yeah. But I have uh, a lot of fun when I fuck up. I mean, it's. <laughs> I like. Just yeah, just like charging. <laughs> <laughs> I like hitting the ball as hard as I can and driving. Yeah. Okay. No, that's that's the fun. <laughs> that's the best spot to be where you're not good enough to care to that care you're about. bad. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Because yeah. then you're not snapping your clubs and yeah, then you're, <laughs> sna- yeah. you're snapping your yeah. clubs. Definitely though. never snaps a club. Yeah, before. that's crazy. Have you? Yeah, that's savage. Yeah. You snapped a club. Yeah. yeah. Really? It's not my putter. That's sick. Dude, you yeah. wait. What are you shooting in golf? Um, my best score is seventy nine. So you're a decent golfer. 
Eh. That's like I that, could not do that right now. I probably shoot like high eighties. I think right the now. best I've ever shot was like eighty eight. Yeah, I think it's good. In my freshman, I mean, I was not a good golfer then, in my opinion. Yeah, I think at least once a month we have to play golf. Oh yeah, because so we say sure. it every single freaking week. We went for a couple weeks. We did, and then we like two. we fell off. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay. It's okay. actually so crazy. Well, let's call this guy out here, Jonas yeah. Smith. <laughs> we just play golf today. Hey, gotta, Jonah, are your hands hurting right now? We got to pick on our friend Jonah. He, we said, let's play golf. He's a, he's a brilliant pianist he's a, yep. um, brilliant. musician oh, brilliant wow. incredible 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 um so the, we can the we best can, yeah we can pick on him a little bit but so i want to go golfing so last time we played golf my hands hurt the next day and i have a lesson tomorrow i said dude you are say it <laughs> just say it that's classic yeah we, we gave him a little bit of crap for that yeah yeah but to be fair, he is a great pianist. No, I think we said this great. last. I think last time I was on the podcast, we started yeah. talking about him too. He needs he's, to get on, bro. He's yeah, has too, he not been on yet? No, nah, bro, he's no. too busy. He's too good he's, at being a piano. Just bring player. his piano here, bro. Like, come on, dude. He could like dude, yeah. actually play on here, and it'd be like, it'd be really it, fun, you yeah. blow you away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it's go. savage. Like you know, La La Land. <laughs> La La you know La La Land. I've, I've heard of it. Yeah, one of my favorite movies. He's literally the guy from La La Land. Not looks wise. He's not Ryan Gosling. But he plays like him. Okay. So yeah, it's really cool. He's got the he's got the perfect pitch, which I'm sure for musicians that's the most annoying, overused term. Uh, yeah. Because the whole uh, you know what perfect pitch is? Yeah. Okay. You know what that is? You know the movie Pitch Perfect, right? Yes. It's basically that. I actually very. That's like the shit with the cups, right? I got my ticket. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now. <laughs> I, was, I thought you were gonna pick it up. But. I love it. Don't no. Don't get me started. Sorry. No, I actually I like. That's that a movie. great movie. I think it's a great. Movie. I'm Pitch not Perfect. Kidding. I know the entire riff off, like bar for bar. Me too. I do, I I don't, but I'll <laughs> say movie. I will. Good movie. Uh, okay. Isn't there okay. two of them? There's three, There's three of them. Three of them. The, three of them. Yeah. The, one, the second the one, one, they go to Eurovision or something. It I keeps getting dumber. It's, yeah. Yeah. It the fourth one I heard they're going to the moon with Vin Diesel. It was a fourth one? No, no, no. no. Just you know, like <laughs> Fast and Furious. <laughs> yeah. You've never I've never seen Fast and Furious, but I got that. Yeah. crossover with Pitch and Perfect. This yeah. man's fucking with me. I love it. <laughs> okay. <I'll, yeah. laughs> okay, wait, let, let, let's stay on track. So now we know we have plenty of things to do. We gotta golf, we gotta watch Pitch Perfect, but perfect pitch basically means somebody that can hear a note and they know what the note is without mm. having a reference okay so some people have relative pitch mm -hmm. where if you play them a note and you tell them what it is and you play another note they could know what that is because they're well versed enough in the instrument sure. to be like oh that's you know this many steps oh, off from that but bro just but has an eight jonah eight. you could be like mm. and he'd be like oh that's a whatever d sharp yeah damn okay yeah, it's, it. it's pretty cool he can also like just hear a song and just freaking yeah damn. but down it's interesting yeah, because i'm pretty sure the ability to do that is a uh it's a genetic thing yeah it's not, wow. it's not yeah, like, yeah so yeah, it's yeah. not acquired like no. can, you, can you acquire it, i though? i thought i like i thought i could acquire it i you, can't so the relative pitch you can get really good at it uh -huh. um but yeah it's a genetic thing but sure. some people might have that and they're they just, just not a, they're not a musician at all so what are the steps to like does he have like a course or something i like? don't know <laughs> wait for getting relative pitch no it's like figuring out if you have that perfect pitch. i uh, i think you would you i think you would know if like i don't know you'd have to you'd have to start, be a musician start being a musician okay. yeah. and then like yeah but like rel i feel like most people who are musicians get relative pitch like yeah pretty fast yeah because like okay even like when i played trumpet like i kind of knew what the next like yeah step up was mm. but it, it, for again for musicians it's likely one of those over talked about things because charlie puth like charlie puth has perfect pitch and there's like a million videos where it's like testing charlie puth's perfect pitch and they're like what's this <laughs> He's like, oh, that's a da da da. And you're like, oh my Just, god. Charlie Puth is like the Ben Shapiro of the Ben piano. Shapiro. That's so funny. <laughs> He's like, well, actually, um, well, this is a D. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You, Let's play you don't like uh, Charlie Puth? No. Do you, don't, do you like Ben Shapiro, though? No. Oh, uh, me either. <laughs> I like to make fun of him. Yeah, me yes. too. Everyone does. Yeah, like, um, actually, him and his sister. <laughs> oh, don't even get me started on his sister. What's her name? Like classically, I'm, Abby or something? I have something? no clue. <laughs> what? I have no. I have absolutely. Uh, she's no a idea. YouTuber. She's kind of like. I just know that Wait, the guy. Wait, Ben Shapiro's sister. Yeah. I, I didn't like, know. The guys love she her. She makes like 
Wait, what? Yeah, guys like guys are like old Ben Shapiro's sister is hot. Mm. Oh. That's a very common. What about Brett one. Cooper? Mm, the comment section. <laughs> I don't know who that is. You know, oh, she you works for Ben Shapiro. She's like the male she, or the female Ben Shapiro. I'm not that deep into the. Yeah, you didn't even know about Greg. She, Carter, she's she's the uh, she's the young girl uh, figure for the Daily Wire. Okay, is yeah, she yeah. blonde? No, no, but no. she she very much looks like Ben Shapiro. Yeah. Funny enough, mm-hmm. that's yeah. kind of the joke. Mm-hmm. Um, let's look this up, dude. Right. Politics on YouTube Shorts has got to be crazy. Yeah, yeah. YouTube Shorts itself is. It's wild. Why are you on there? I'm on YouTube. Shorts. Why? Because I don't, I don't want to spend as much time on Instagram. Oh, I have seen her. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. She's cool. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to be something like special. No, no. Uh, hey. I mean, she's special. Not to, <laughs> to someone else. But not to me. <laughs> um, oh, my goodness. Man. Yeah, no. Politics on, on Reels is tough. It's wild. Yeah. <laughs> it, it is. I'm strictly a TikTok girl. Really? No Not reels. a reel? No. Reels is the best. Reels is. is the best. But reels, reels is, is the, best. the most addictive. I, besides, I think TikTok's pretty addictive, but reels, like, because you're already on Instagram to look at something TikTok else, like sucks. a DM, and then you go to reels and you're just sucked in. Yeah. You're freaking, you're down the Reels and Twitter are the best. Twitter's, Twitter's good, but man, I can't. I get there's some freaky stuff on oh yeah, yeah. On, yeah on that app. TikTok used to be where it was all the crazy stuff. Mm-hmm. Now it's reels. It's reels, bro. Reels. And, yeah. and every Twitter. every yeah. comment section, bro, on Instagram reels is like, yo, this is crazy. yeah. I think well, <laughs> that cool. TikTok ban. Yeah, that's gonna. You, th- it, you think it's gonna happen? No, mm-hmm. I I think it might. Nah, I think. An American company is just going to buy it and then turn oh, it into, really? you know. Well, if American company buys it, then good. Then yeah, but th- then it'll just be super censored, neutered, whatever, and then it's going to suck. It's going to die? Yeah, I think Do so. Do you think TikTok will die? I don't know. I hope it does. Everything dies yeah. eventually. Yeah. That's true. Mm. Dude, rest in peace Vine. Although, oh, Vine, oh, Vine was the best. Yeah. Vine was actually the I, best. I, but I don't think, I think TikTok is more common with Vine, but I don't think Instagram or Facebook or Twitter are ever going to die. Yeah, maybe there not. There are two those, because think about it, Google... Like Google is not going to get replaced as a search mm, engine. Yeah, I, I don't. I don't see that. No, nope. I don't see that happening. I don't. Come on, Duck, Duck, Go, bro. Duck, that Duck, yeah, Go. but Duck, Duck, Go is owned by Google. I think is it really? Yeah, I'm not even percent sure. And then also like, there's like Bing is owned by someone. They're all owned mm-hmm. by like other people. So like, yeah. Firefox is owned, I think now too. So like, I mean, there's like ten people in this world that own everything. So yeah, true. That's true. I mean. <laughs> Yeah, there's yeah. it's uh, I mean, Disney Fortnite is partially owned by Disney, <laughs> Fort, bro. Fortnite. I didn't realize it was a Fortnite bottle. That's I like that. That's criminal. Thanks. Yeah, that's so it was funny. worth the value. It was not, it was $25. <laughs> was it really? oh, that's but, insane. Yeah, yeah, oh it was 25 God. bucks at Target. I, I saw what happened was I was uh, I, I had a Stanley for a while, which by the hey. yeah, I yeah. Hey, hey! <laughs> I got a Stanley. <laughs> um, I had a Stanley for a while, and then I was like, I like couldn't find my. I think I lost my Stanley, mm-hmm. and I was like, oh no! And I was about to go to practice, and I had to get a. I was. I went to Target to find a Stanley, and mm-hmm. they had no Stanley, so I was like, the quickest turn of like, events. No way, because mm. this is a nice bottle. It's, it's nice. Oh, yeah. It was yeah. twenty five dollars. It would be so, better if it said Apex Legends on it. Montego. It's a slim. Oh, slim. <laughs> but oh. You on top of the Apex Le- Legends leaderboard? Contigo. A- a- yeah. I was. Yeah. You Were you were. really? Mm-hmm. It was. You okay. was. What happened? <laughs> what happened? What happened? Yeah. What happened? <laughs> Not the Fortnite Stop conversation. No, this was like yeah, last... junior year of college. This is a long time. <laughs> last ago. time I was, dude. This is every episode. Some wait, really? Fortnite came out last. La- really? Dude, yeah. Wait, what was the last time? Hell Divers. Or something? No. Do you play Hell Divers, Brandon? Mm-hmm. I don't yeah. know what that is. You what is that? Divers? No, no, I know what it is. Though. You do? Huh? It's like this new game that's very popular, but I I have not played it yet. I don't play games. I pl- I play <laughs> Minecraft and that's it. Do you really? I love Minecraft. That's crazy. I want to start. I've I've been trying to start a realm. So bad, dude. That's what I I we were literally talking about how Minecraft was the best game. Ever. It is. It's, it's such. That's a game. That, speaking of things that never went away. <sighs> yeah. Like that. Crew's like, oh, I love. You never this. play Minecraft? No. Really? Dude, you're such a loser, bro. I swear. Why not? To God. What happened? What do you do at night? No, no, no. no. Um, not play Minecraft. I think I reflect. <laughs> no, but I can't be in that headspace. You all never play. <laughs> See, but having a having the combo with you doesn't have to be bad. You know, it can feel good. 
I'm I'm pretty now, cool to me. <laughs> I just I need that combo with myself like maybe once or twice a week. The other yeah, time yeah, yeah. I need. When you play mm. when you play Minecraft, are you playing like are you doing a realm? Or are you doing like or are you doing like the PVE Bro, server? We almost talked no, about something doing... important. My buddy made a realm and we were like grinding that for like three four months. And then and somebody then, griefed. No, he changed it. And we, I signed in one time. It was a whole different world, and everything that we did was just gone. See, usually oh my, my the, it's the worst. Minecraft thing. realms go one of two ways: someone forgets the login, or another player like bombs someone else's base, and then it's and like, it just gets and fucked. It's just, it's, just, yeah. it's just chaos. Yeah. So heartbreak. <laughs> um, let me think of a much better, more helpful topic. Apex, Apex Legends. No, no. Our video game is making people more violent. Oh Ooh. god! Now you sound like mm. my communication class. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it sounds like a, like a, just a college class right here. No, seriously, that's like I'm the not... topic of every comm class you'll take. Really? I'm sure. Yeah. Because it was a big study in the '90s. It was a big. I did study a paper on how video games increase cognitive function in college. Really? Mm -hmm. How so? It just does. It do. <gasps> it do. That's it, a, it, I it just do. destroyed it you do. right there. <laughs> this is a message to the gremlins. Video games improve cognitive <laughs> function. Yeah. Cite your source. It do. Yeah. It do. It does. It be like that. Yeah. No, video games are so like that's the one thing that I've always wondered though is like you talk about evolving media. What about evolving like or where are games gonna go? Like the video VR man. The that's... video with the VR lady? Is that really the next <laughs> is that the next step that we're just got forty year old women running into, into the oven? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that when you said Vine, that's what I was I bring this up every time. The like first thing I saved on Vine. Yeah. Hey Macaulay, come running here, come get oh, your yeah, juice. Like, I, great, I yeah. love yeah. that video. And then, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> what it's like a <laughs> when she <yelled. laughs> I oh my god that, vine, that was a good app man vine was like peak uh feeling is it yeah. because what when, yeah. when did it get shut down 2017 oh. 2016 2016 Jeez. i don't know i would just go through i would like a handful of them and then when i would hang out with my friends it's like guys i refreshed the library let's watch vines Dude, i just go I, through. i'd do anything to get back my own my old likes Dude, my same. Vine library. Well, that, and now Dude. you're like now if you want to watch the old if you ever feel nostalgic you, you can go you go to you YouTube, go youtube and you watch the vine compilation yeah. from uh lele pods oh, oh lele pods my. holy shit Dude. <laughs> or what from, the hell? do you remember Pot? king batch yeah, I call him King Bach. People say okay. it's King Batch, Dude. but I call him King Bach. He's like King Batch when he would do like wall flips and stuff. Yeah, like, yeah. this guy's awesome. Oh, and then that like Daystorm power. Daystorm, dude. I don't what know about, about uh? Really? I can list them all. Oh I can list Daystorm them all. Daystorm was so. I, can, I love. Him. What about uh? Oh, what about uh? Thomas. Uh, there's that other guy. That was the other really popular one. Um, he's a guy in the classrooms. Like no teacher. Yeah, I'll I be him. uh. And then Cody Ko got Cody Ko. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and then uh. And Drew Gooden. Drew Gooden, but Drew Gooden was oh, and Danny Gonzalez. He got big off of mine too. And then, um, what the heck? dude, there's so many. Daystorm, bro. Yeah, Daystorm power. <laughs> no, yeah. and then uh, Anwar Jarabi or whatever. Uh, you remember that guy who was always with? Uh, I think so. He was doing. And then dude, it, it was that whole that that crew, Lele Pons, Lele Pons group. group. That was just. Yeah. That was Hannah cool. stocking, <laughs> yeah. And our thing is like the, the eye or whatever. Yeah, she does like the cross eye thing. Like you would just always see that. You'd be like, what? what? And then uh, no, Lily Pod's thing was always she's falling, like she'd fall yeah. down. It's like, dude, that's like that's like brain dead humor. It's brain mm -hmm. rot. That it's is the, that is the worst. I mm -hmm. feel like. And then oh no, Daystorm gosh. Power would be like his. Cheating on someone dude, and then that's getting just so caught, funny, and then uh, that's so absurd, dude. There was, and then there would be like hidden gems from like insane people where you'd find some like really funny stuff that was just like, and that yeah. was like the Instagram reels of the dude, day. Dude, that was yeah. the what's nine plus ten twenty one. Yeah, dude, that yeah, shit. or uh, or these nuts, the D's yeah, these nuts, nuts dude, and then yeah. uh, man, there were a handful of some funny yeah. people, dude. <laughs> I, I I just remember this one dude. I saw him recently. I can't remember who showed me a video, but he did a. You know, The Bachelor, how the show works. Yeah. yeah. So he he was doing, he was all three parts. You know how people just do little skits, but they're everybody. Oh, yeah. And he's the he's the girl <laughs> handing out the rose. And they always say the guy's name, like, Brennan, will you accept this yes. rose? And he's just like, uh, like, Jared, will you hand this rose to Luke? And I always thought that was the funniest thing ever, just imagining, like, that actually happening. But there were just... 
like three or four people you'd scroll through. Mm-hmm. I, I would just go down their thing for oh, days. Yeah. Like, well, there were classic. like David Dobrik also got David massive. Dobrik, yeah, and the Paul brothers and the Paul brothers dude, got they, dude, they, yeah, they, they, they started as a Vine. Yeah, but those guys like towards the end of Vine, I remember like those were the guys that were not on Vine anymore because mm-hmm. they were on they moved to YouTube. YouTube. Mm-hmm. They started moving. Yeah, that was like it was like a, a that was like to transition. Do. It was yeah. like yeah. you went Vine, YouTube, and I think now it's kind of similar. You go Instagram Reel or TikTok to YouTube. Mm-hmm. YouTube is the pinnacle. YouTube's the king. It is. YouTube's it the is. pinnacle. Yeah. It's, it's always going to be the pinnacle because that's where you get the most international viewers. Is how yeah. I see it. It's like being on Disney and then you release horrible music just as a natural mm-hmm. evolution. Yeah. yeah. Or and then or, and then you eventually make it as a serious actor later in life. Which is what's and a drug going. addict, and and garbage or a drug, or a drug. <laughs> so Dude, trash. That's like uh, I saw a clip recently of. Uh, did you guys ever watch Kids React? Yes, the fine, the fine bros. bros. Dude, oh yeah. my god! I I watched a clip recently of um, these guys who were both on the Fine Bros and they were in college, getting interviewed. And they were in Kids React, and one of the guys is like, "I always had a crush on the one girl from from Teen Dude. React." Do you remember? Yes, Leah Marie. I think so, That's bro. I, I, I would gosh. go back and watch them because there were some cuties it, like, on there. It's like, yeah, yeah. I mean, you watch them today? <laughs> today? No, you, this oh, was okay. like a long ass oh, time ago. Okay. But <laughs> if you brought it back up, you're like, yep, that one, that one. No, <laughs> but like, the, the girl that was that. No, like, Lisa she, Marie, the blonde one. She became like a crack addict. Uh, what yeah, the fuck? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 She, she, it went downhill. Yeah, yeah. No. Like, it was Dude, bad. that sucks. It, it sucks, but like, the guys were just like, yeah, bro, she's in a crack house somewhere. They were just freaking, <laughs> they were just like, just freaking like going off. Oh, on her. I was so like, funny. dude, that is so crazy. And they were talking about, like, they were like, fuck the Fine Bros. Yeah. Fine Bros screwed us. You know what's crazy is all those uh, 2000s kid nostalgia videos mm-hmm. or whatever. And it'll just be these clips that make your stomach twist. Yep. Like, oh my God. It's just these defining moments or like mm-hmm. TV shows or it'll show like, you know, outside. Outside <laughs> playgrounds and stuff, yeah. dude. Yeah. Well, we, yeah. Dude, we live in a fucking yeah. world where everything is, like, it's commodified. Yeah. yeah it's... Well, you were talking about um, the third spaces or something, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, what is that? Well, it's kind of this, like, notion that our society, especially in America, has lost the third space mm. where um, people go home. And they go to work or they go to school. And then there's a third location that they should go to, to like socialize. Like historically. Yeah. yeah. Like it could be Mm -hmm. diners. It could be bookstores, Mm -hmm. the bar. Like I feel like a lot of people feel lonely or don't feel connected with their community because they've lost that third space that they go to Mm -hmm. on a regular basis and like make connections. Mm -hmm. So like for us in the gym, we kind of have this. That's, your that's third our third space. space. Yeah, that's yeah. our third space, but a lot of people don't do that. I think that for a lot of people, it used to be religious spaces. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, 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 for sure. But now people are a lot Bro, less religious. Or it could be like clubs. Yeah. You know, like your mom could have been a part yeah. of a sewing club. club. The book club. Yeah. Book clubs, I feel like, like I remember my mom, I think a lot, of, oh my God, I'm bleeding. Um, Look at you. But um, job, I did start picking up my finger. But, Heck yeah. Um, <laughs> you just have to. That's what Low I blood rich Iron, bro. There you go. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Yummy. What is like liver? Uh, no, um, I think that COVID really, really killed that. Mm-hmm. I think That's I think it was dying trash. before. I think so. I think so. You think so? With the, you think because of the internet? Media. I yeah. think. I've never had something reasonable to do. Like, really? It, I mean, even now, we were talking about this earlier. It's Saturday, it's beautiful out. Mm hmm. I just I just work. I just edit something and then I that's maybe true. go play soccer outside, mm-hmm. by, like in the parking lot oh, by nice. myself, and then I go to the gym. Do you yeah. think that's a? And you were saying it was a, maybe a Raleigh thing. I think other locations have better things to do. Well, for well, sure. well what other things? Like, like let's be specific here. Well, it's it's wellness. Like things. in terms of it's, like a community oriented thing. Yeah, I think some places are more. Focus like the culture revolves around different things. I'm not saying that every place doesn't have most people going and drinking, most mm-hmm. people just doing the normal thing to do. But some places do have, mm-hmm. you know, the the run clubs and mm-hmm. the sports and the mm-hmm. whatever. And it's like it's an age group thing too because mm-hmm. here every club everything is like a it's a mom thing. 
or like a middle-aged person holding their beers out kind of thing. Like I looked up Raleigh Run Club the other day. It's like, oh yeah, brewery. Yeah, yeah, yeah brewery. it's yeah. And, and it's not you know twenty to twenty five or twenty to thirty year olds that are active and ambitious and whatever yeah. else doing something productive. Yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah. I've seen. Um, a lot of Facebook groups for things, yeah. but then that's like See, the older. My, right, right. My, yeah. my thing is like, I feel like our generation and maybe even generations before us have gotten too comfortable with the weekly nights or the weekends just being filled with technology. Yeah. Like before technology, you had nothing to do. Mm-hmm. And so yeah. there was more of an incentive to go out to form mm-hmm. those connections, those communities. So I have a, I have a, I have a theory on this now okay. that I've actually just thought about. Oh, I know. Okay. I, I have my theory. Do you know? Too. Do you, do you, <laughs> Maybe let's all the same theories. one. Possibly. I think that a the lot, crew knows mine. I think. I think it's the dating apps. I think okay. a lot. I think. I think the don't reason, get me started on dating well, apps. I think that I think they started they, up straight up garbage. I, I think yeah. the, re, the the reason why people don't go out anymore is because you're not looking for um like a potential partner. I think that's a re, a lot a large reason yeah. that people go out is for a potential partner. And or just for a connection. Or for a connection. And now the dating app offers for majority of people a hookup or a gr- potential girlfriend or boyfriend. Or distraction. Or mm-hmm. that's huge. Or yeah, yeah, a that's... distraction. Or they now even have dating apps, which I think was the dumbest thing that dating apps ever could have done was make a friend a option. A friendship <laughs> option, yeah. That's so stupid. What is this? <laughs> Since when did that? You did not know that? Yeah, you no. can No, they you all can have like, they all yeah, have a friend option. You can select It's like things. yeah, and like and and like guys and girls like will just join the app just to do the friend option. And then you know what they do sometimes is that people will hook up with people in the friend option, which is insane to me. Was that your theory too? No, mine was completely. Really? Okay, wait, oh, what's, what's okay. Well, I want to hear, I wanna is, hear your theory because yeah, I, I may go down a rabbit hole with this. Okay. Well, I, I was just going to say. We should, but this is just a matrix attack. <laughs> <laughs> I love this guy, man. I love it. The people. Do it. You got to do it in the accent, bro. <laughs> Dude, I, I don't have it's not as good as yours, bro. I can't even do it. I give it who the, is it? Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate says it's a matrix tag? Yeah. Is that what well, he said? It, it's on the tag. It's more What does like, Jay Waller say? Yeah, what, what would Jay if you're Waller not in the, scenario? If you're not in the dating apps or whatever. Yeah, yeah, no. I don't know. I just think Jay that, Waller, if you're not in the dating apps wearing boot cup jeans, yeah. you better not wear it. Man, I saw her on Bumble. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> bro, that's a pretty good. Okay, anyways, that's explain. Crazy. Explain, explain. Bro, I did <sighs> I kind of lost it after. <laughs> no, so you said it's a, you said it's an attack um, of the. Oh, matrix. I don't think it's an attack. I think it's just the people in charge don't want what's best for the entire population, so they're trying yeah. to weaken everyone mm-hmm. by yeah, yeah. through the use of technology, through the use of pharmaceuticals, through the use of all these billion dollar industries, mm-hmm. and um, you know, people that are just systematic in a way. You know, they do the same stuff every day. They go, they go to work. You know, they come home. Um, they don't have that third space, yeah. right? They're yeah. not. They don't care. Yeah. They're just doing I, what they can do to survive. I and that's think, a gr- that's a gear in the system. I don't yep. think the system intentionally is out to get our generation or the previous ones. I generally think the system is self serving. I think it's yeah. I think it just became yeah. it just became a monster. You're not a doctor if you don't have customers. How do you get customers? You have people that rely on you for no. their health and their well being. You know. Yeah, I think it, it just like kind of became what it like. The, like I don't think people realize how dangerous the internet is. Oh, it's mm. terrible. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but it's a great. But now, it's good and bad. Well, the the whole thing is like now, like I'm trying to play guitar. Mm-hmm. I would twenty years ago, I probably would not have tried to play guitar because it would have been like just me reading a book. Yeah. So I think that that's a really awesome thing from the internet. The internet can be a tool. It can. Mm-hmm. It and can. you can use it tool but you can correctly. Get that, you, can get down that, you can get down that yeah. rabbit hole. Yeah. It's, it's crazy. And just how much information is out there and how it's stored now and like how technology has advanced. So what I'm doing right now, like what my career is related to is cybersecurity. Yeah. So I'm interested in, in the cloud, which is like. You know, you've, you guys have probably all heard of the cloud, but yeah, it's a yeah. very hard concept to wrap your brain around because a typical, like, network infrastructure relies on, like, you know, a router, a switch, a computer. A computer connects to the switch. A, snitch, a switch connects to the router. Something physical. Which is associated with your internet service provider, and that's how you get access to information. But with a cloud, instead of having that typical infrastructure, it's all stored in a data center somewhere else. So Microsoft has one, Azure. Mm. 
Um, Amazon has one, AWS. You've probably heard of AWS. And then Google also has a cloud. And then there's also many other different private clouds, but those are kind of the three main ones. And instead of having, you know, all of these different smaller, um, I guess they're called Soho mm. environments, everything's in the cloud now. Mm -hmm. So it, it's just, it's a very, how it's advanced at that is very technologically, like, it's just very difficult. Mm -hmm. And where it's going, I just don't know. Yeah, yeah. So you're saying, like, the information where it's held. Yeah. Like, like, makes a difference. I'm reading a book on like, like cyber terrorism right now. Just like everything with cyber security. That's so scary. And <laughs> dude, it, it, it's stuff you don't even think about. It's like, you know, if, if this computer controls a plane that's dropping a bomb, you someone could hack into the computer and change the course of the plane to drop it on like your own city or something, mm. something like that. Well, what about oh, was it two years ago, three years ago when they hacked that uh, gas plant? It was like, Ooh, and then yeah. it caused the gas shortage in North Carolina. Yeah. yeah. That was yeah. insane. Yeah. I remember that. Yeah. Like, that was like, and yeah, they literally it, just, they, nobody like, nobody went in and it with guns. Yeah. It was a physical like, attack. The, it was a the, cyber attack. Yeah. Because we haven't, we didn't think about implementing this type of security to our information until like this past, like, you know, two decades. Mm. And so if someone really wanted to like mess things up, it's, you do it through information technology. Hmm. And it's very, you know, very um, just dense and yeah. hard to hard to understand. Grade. Yeah, it's very hard. Like wow. I, mean, I know a very base level understanding of everything. There's just it goes right. so deep. It's more conceptual. So yeah, it's more just understanding the dynamic of mm -hmm. someone's motive to do a certain yeah. thing. I think that's what's interesting is most people have kind of a. I don't know, maybe a, a genuine outlook or, or genuine intent. Mm -hmm. And then to try and understand somebody who literally does not have that mm -hmm. is very difficult. Oh, yeah. Well, these people, the people who are doing the cyber attacks are not, like, usually. Immoral. They're not normal. <laughs> I, mean, I, just mean, I just mean in general, mm. not even in that category. Just then, yeah. the, the general people that truly do not have genuine intent. Right, they're not in the best interest of mm -hmm. anybody but themselves, which I would say is not in the best interest of themselves. Mm -hmm. Also, um, but yeah, it's it's tough to put yourself in that mind space because you know, again, most people have kind of just like a oh, if I put myself in a good spot yeah. and, and have good relationships, that might be yeah. a good thing. Uh, some people are destructive. Oh yeah, not you know, people is there's some people out there that just. They just don't care, you know, yeah. they, they just will do whatever. And that's the scary part. Cause if they yeah. gain a lot of knowledge, hmm. you know, <clears throat> they're you, not going to put it to good. Do you think that, because it, it seems like there's <laughs> more, <laughs> <getting intense>. yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it seems like there's more of an opportunity to do that because mm -hmm. of the availability yes. of information. Yes. But do you think that that's a product or do you think that that's, an exposed reality of just how people are. I think that's just a projection of how we've came. Yeah. Just based off of advancements in technology. That just was going to happen regardless. Mm. So like human nature exposed. Yeah. I think just curiosity. Hmm. Cause humans are always going to be curious. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. It's a uh... super deep. What is it like? Sir? Is it survival? <laughs> What do you mean? Just like, oh, like, like why, like where curiosity, curiosity stems from or just. Yeah. Like what's the. I don't know. I, don't know. I feel like we have more uh, worry of people being more like Wally, -E, like just fat, like robotic mm. and like in the, uh, yeah. than, than any, than any, like, because at least um, Americans. Yeah. And, and just like Western world, Western world. I think England also. Oh like, dude. And anyone don't like get me started on England, bro. Have, <laughs> have you been? Have you been? No, but I hate it. Really? Why? <laughs> Dude, I love I, it. Man. I've just heard a lot of a lot of garbage about it. How it's similar to here and England. Yeah. No, I think it's very different. Really? I've been a few times. It's uh, definitely the, the, every. That's one thing. Is like, I mean, I don't have anything to say about England. I, I've never <laughs> been there, but it's like I go to Canada twice a year to okay. visit my family, and that place is radically different than the U.S. Okay. There are so many like the like the cultural differences and are like insane. Like mm -hmm. not just kilometers. And, and you're, just, you're just talking about Canada? I'm talking about Canada. I'm talking about England. Both they're of them? All, like, oh, okay. They're so different. It's, okay. People think differently mm. there. 
like mm. then they there's mm. just not there's not there's an American culture, like I think it uh, with see this, that with the same with the same with people like us people like us, our our families are probably said you got to go to college. I mean, you didn't go to college, but like sorry, you got like most people say you got to go to college. Your uh-huh. parents say you got to go to college. You have to get a good grade in high school. You have to get a job after that. Like the culture in those places is just it's it's different like so that's not like some people are like that it's just different it's it's so radically like yeah people yeah would, yeah there's I, there's people who think differently here i too. think that's the problem about like this stuff too with like racism and stuff is because Whoa. diversity that I, I i didn't mean to bring that no, up out dude, of nowhere I'm, but i'm i think I'm on that the ride let's go diversity is based off of how people think rather than what color yeah is their yeah, skin. yeah yeah you know like it makes no sense how, you know, you could hire someone based off that or someone can be let into college based off of just how they look like. Well, that, that's than... that's a lot of the people compare countries. Oh. I'm like, okay, don't try to compare something that works in Sweden and the United States mm-hmm. because you want to know what there is zero of in Sweden is diversity. If everybody is coming from the same place and everybody looks the same, everyone does the same things, like, yeah, certain things might work. Well, also, but it, Sweden, I think about it from an economic standpoint. The U.S. is 100% a consumer economy. Yeah. 100%. If you yeah. think about everything that you the U.S. values, it's like McDonald's. That's garbage. It's like, yeah. it, it's, well, it's just like Nike, like anything consumer is yeah. the U.S. Uh, there's definitely innovation, but like, it's well i think i mostly agree with crew because you can't take things out of its context like there's so much cultural context with america and with our history in regards to many different aspects Mm -hmm. that we can't ignore we can't compare ourselves to someone else necessarily because and they can't do the same yeah 100 no so they're they're well they're yeah i think but from economic standpoint it's completely different like that's where a lot Mm. that's where a lot of that stuff comes from is like people will be like well, the U.S. should be on a 100% free healthcare system, but we're a consumer economy that, like, I, it's, right, it's like, right. I, I don't know how you could even... Well, you know what sucks is that somehow, I guess, well, I think at the heart of capitalism, let's say, you shouldn't, you shouldn't win big in capitalism unless you're providing something extremely valuable. Mm. But it's when you change the view of what's valuable mm. to people as a whole, which I, I don't know mm. how you do that, but it seems as if somebody's been really good at that. Mm. Then you can win big and yeah. be against the people. That's, yeah. And they're rooting for you to win. That's that whole thing. Well, that's the thing about the U.S. It's like it's the uh, the American dream is very much like a... Uh, Pick you up by your bootstraps. Yeah, it's like yeah. if you if you fail in the U.S., you're homeless or mm. you're very broke. In the U.S., if you fail, like, that is seen as, like, something against you. Like, there's something yeah. wrong with you. Not, like, the system is against you. Yeah, or... but in reality, like, it, it, yeah, it's just, like, there's a, yeah, there's... There's a system, and you... You have to, like, if you do well in the U.S., like, you live the dream. It's very fail or <laughs> survive to fail, honestly. Like, yeah, it's one or the other. I mean, none of these systems last if everyone is ambitious and autonomous and healthy um, and free thinking and all well, of those. Well, they can things. last with a small population. Like that's, yeah. that's why, that's why the Nordic countries like do well. They have, they have a small population regardless. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know. It's uh again, I think the whole like systematic discussion or whatever is just a weird one You're because wild. it, it's like uh, them, a they like who who yeah, is, who is they, yeah. they who them? Who yeah, who is they them? Yeah. Who, is, yeah. <laughs> who runs the system? No, it's rough. It's some honestly, it's something I'm not well versed in, and I haven't thought about in a while mm. because yeah, it's like rough. It's kind of like what you were saying earlier. It's like kind of rough to think about. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's it's so just, much. It's so complicated. I mean, a lot I'm of not, there's I'm so much is out of it. So, yeah. Me too. I'm honestly. just a girl. <laughs> I mean, who knows yeah. nowadays, right? She's just like, a skater. He's just a skater boy. He's a skater boy. <laughs> Let's go. Looking uh, for her. Hey. Nah. I, just, I just, I like to understand what's happening around yeah. the world and yeah. why it's happening. That's why I don't have any opinions on any of the worst. I don't truly know what's happening because the well, media has portrayed itself to be lying a lot. So it's like, how can, you ta- also, how can you take any advice well, from Well, here's me? the thing. No matter what you say about anything that happens outside of your direct household there's 
absolutely nothing that's going to change. Dude, that, yeah, I mean, that's true. That's the... At least about, like, general global issues like that. Yeah. Like, sure, you can donate, <clears throat> like, money and stuff for aid, but, like... They're not going to sway the opinion of major powers. Yeah, I, th- I think I could. Yeah, yeah let just me, get, let me get, get up in there. Right. <laughs> Let's see. Give us your best pitch. <laughs> listen, listen. She's going to pull out her Costco card. Yeah, be like, which I it. have no evidence that I you did. have. It's in my car. Okay, what car? I, I yeah, yeah. Did you, can you, can yeah. Do you even have a car? Yeah, we don't even know. Take a look. What car do you drive? A Jeep Renegade. Renegade. Okay. Oh, the the square one. Was oh, it the red one over there? Yeah. Yeah. How do you That's Renegade? cool. Do you know a okay. Renegade? Wait, wait. Hey. I mm. forgot. Oh, I forgot. That's okay. I never knew. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Hey, don't like ask. Face yeah. All right. I'm chronically, right <laughs> chronically online. Hater right here. Chronically online. Sorry. I am chronically. Do you know how to gritty? Huh? Oh, never mind. Of course I know how to gritty. Oh, let's I go. take offense. All right. Hey. You don't have to show us that. I bite my tongue. What does that mean? What does that mean? From um, Shakespeare. Romeo and Juliet. You said you didn't mm. know much about the system. Talking about Shakespeare. <laughs> I am to strictly, be I am strictly like a humanities girly. Like Are you I a, devote a lot of my time to like media. You're a communications major? Mm-hmm. But you know, okay. film. but you know, oh, I was going to, I was going to ask you about that. What is it like? Ooh. What are you actually Filming. learning? Like, are oh. you nothing? How to, nothing. No, okay. you're, you're cool. watching. Yeah, are you watching a lot of movies? I'm guessing. Oh yeah. 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 I, I, I knew a film major at one point and they just said they watched a lot of movies. I watch a lot of movies and mm. the production classes are honestly so base level mm. that I'm not learning anything in that. Uh, and I don't really well, learn anything in mm. the film. Classes. What's your favorite movie of the last year of the last year yeah i'll have to pull out my letterbox oh wow. you could see so your letterbox Damn. girl okay wait i'm a film major i have to be uh, okay. wait 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 yeah, what, yeah, is, into, what is like production are we talking like video editing filming right color, so audio? everything that i'm assuming you taught yourself right okay is what i'm learning i'm paying for and basically and i taught myself pretty much the same things mm-hmm because it is a passion, it's a hobby. Yeah, yeah. And then I go to class and I'm like, oh, okay. this is a double major, right? Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What well, What do you edit on? Um, on Premiere. Premiere. Oh, oh really? I've wow. seen uh, in yeah. class, but like, I can't afford Premiere right now. Do you so get I, Premiere for oh, free? You can get it for you can get it through school. I bet you can only use Dude. it on, oh, on the, the school on computer. No. Oh, computer. I cannot. Is, I took. A, I have words I took, for that. I took a film class. And I, we edited a film on Premiere Pro, and I can only use it on the school computer. Yeah. I couldn't even take it home That's to do my so homework. No. Just, no. Uh-uh. Yeah. Not even state? Like, what the heck? That's crazy. And I know other colleges don't do it like that. So you use, like, so, iMovie or something? Or? I use iMovie right now. Okay. And you're doing YouTube, yeah? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Bring it up. Expose. We're watching it right now. Yeah. All of so how many videos you got out? I don't know. 20, I I make those videos truly as like it is fun and it is a passion for me, and then I put them out in the void and I never think about them again. Is that why? Oh, yeah, that's why that's is that why you picked the film major, or did you pick it? Yeah, you like, like... I picked it because I know I love all things video and all things media. F- media, okay. and I hope to have a profession in video. Like what? I think I'm going to move out to Wilmington for a couple of years. Okay. Maybe mm, try the good. film industry out there, TV industry. There is a big film industry out there. Yeah. They okay. film, I mean, right now it's like Outer Banks and yeah. the summer I turn pretty. But like work mm. is work. Okay. Um, and then, I don't know. I mean, would you see yourself Whatever. as more of like a, you know, you're out there shooting video or like editing, you know, post an actress. Any, ooh. Oh, true. I don't think I can act. I feel like you could. Yeah. It would be fun. I feel like you've got the... But the dream... Here's the dream. Okay. Travel the, the world, mm. film the myself d- traveling the world mm. and eating food and going... Okay. To Influenza. So you, yeah. yeah. Influenza, but like specifically traveling the you world. You know what's crazy is I, I've like... I felt like that was my kind of dream. Because my job... My yeah. favorite part of my job is going to different like campuses yeah. and then like trying food. Yeah. And like... Like and experiencing, and experiencing culture, the culture, learning culture, about it. And new stuff. Ooh. So doing that, <laughs> love to, I love to travel. The culture. Bro, start, yeah. start vlogging, bro. Come on. i so people tell people tell me that they say I should start vlogging, bro. I did not know how the fuck. I, Dude, well, that's why you got to do it, bro. You just gotta. What's going on, guys? <laughs> We're back with another video. Yeah. Today. Frat party Make tonight. Sure <laughs> slam that post notification. Bell. Yeah, yeah. I just don't know what how I can. I don't know. I feel like Dude, I just watch think... someone's video and then copy it. Mm-hmm. 
Dude, yeah, because the more you gonna do take it, time, the more yeah. you find. I'm so. I feel like I'm so out, like so natural outside of a camera setting. Mm-hmm. That on that's cam- why once you start doing it, you start to. That, you that, open up. I view yeah. that as very cringe. I also. I do too. The thing is, is I like. <laughs> I don't. Yeah, I don't film in front of other people. Like oh, I can't. No, that's like, horrendous. Yeah. I can't do that. Yeah. I think the biggest thing for me is like I love to take things all in. Mm. Like, that's why it's hard for okay. me to take out my phone. Like I wanted to take a camera on my trips to take pictures of like really cool. There's a mm-hmm. o- Oka. Oh, what's the name of the park? It's a park south of Auburn, Alabama. Mm. Like insanely pretty park. It's like super it's insane and i wanted to just take pictures out there with a the camera but i'm like also like i can't i'm just yeah. taking it all in mm. what if you hired someone no I would okay know. see that's I such a ha- dude if you could just i would never do, do no. what you want to do mm-hmm. and then all of the literal work is done the the film the freaking yeah, the setting C- up the, the lights CEO the, of a business that's like, what that is called <laughs> yeah if we just pulled up to this table and just chat we don't have, I, I mean like I'm doing the editing, I set up the friggin' mics, I'm doing all this yeah. crap. That would be insane. You know that's, that's. I mean that's the goal, the dream. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean that's the plan. Miss, Miss, my yeah, mom, that's my mom texts me. She sent me applications to work for Mr. Beast. Really? That's to do stuff like that for him. And his yeah, video that's. Creation. I'd like you to should, though. Yeah, yeah, do it. Why not? I agree. He's here. Totally. Yeah. Oh, I, it's a full time position. I doubt I'm gonna get that. But yeah, why not? What? Uh, what how much time do you have left in your major? Uh, I graduate next May. Okay. Oh, nice. Let's go. Let's go. So you're going to, you're, yeah, you're close to I'm the, close. yeah. <laughs> Have you traveled before? Like out of the country? I've been to Italy. That's pretty That's cool. it. I've been to Italy yeah. twice and then I've done some travel. So only Italy US. twice. Yeah. Where, where specific? I did North and I did South. So like I did Lake like a Cuomo. Southern Luth. Uh, no, not yet. I want to go there. Star Wars. Mm-hmm. That's what um, I was going to say. How, how often like, are you making a YouTube video or like... Some not, content. No. Not much. I feel like you should just start. Probably freaking, like one. I'm trying. You gotta crank I, them I, I want to. Yeah. You should be like hammering videos. Yeah. I'm, I'm doing my best. So probably Come like on. once or two a month. Okay. It's just not Yeah. If, if you can, like but. a YouTube video a week, bro. I wish I had enough time for that, but I don't. Okay, hold on. I just don't. Hold on. How long are your videos? Uh, they're like, they're longer. Mm. They're like five to ten minutes. Okay. See, but you're not doing like heavy editing, right? I must admit, I have not watched one of your YouTube That's videos okay. yet, so I need to. I, need I to do like. Is it mainly like storytelling, like cut, like organizing, or are you in there freaking like getting the? No, I'm. I'm adding like... like fun sound effects and like overlays uh-huh. and green screens. Okay. And... Okay. So. Okay. So it's a lot. It's more than just like cutting it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And putting right. it together. No, for sure. Okay. What about you editing your videos? What about it? How how often? How many days do you make a week? One a day. Well, like one reel a day. These are I'm shorts. Like, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. So In total video. Do you make YouTube videos or no? I mean, I post shorts. I mean, I post shorts, TikToks, and reels. So I do. I I stagger them. So I post a reel a day, and then the reel I posted yesterday gets posted to TikTok, and then the one from two days ago gets posted as shorts. So it's like a sequence. And then I'm also posting like me doing like labs and projects for my cybersecurity degree on my website. So oh, I do, I'm starting to do those. Nice. But it's it's just like I don't know. I hate reels. It's so annoying. Like <laughs> I, I don't know what to post anymore. I just like. You can tell the posts that I don't try at all anymore. They're just like <laughs> five seconds long, just like a quote or something. But, and then I like sometimes I'll be inspired by like my feed is just ideas for right. me mm-hmm. to like go off of. And then sometimes it is well, sometimes it doesn't. But Dude. I don't know, it's just frustrating. I, I I'm yeah. feeling like how you did, but like it took you like what five years to no nah, no nah, like two years of posting mm-hmm. twice a day basically. Okay. Um, so I've been about like a year posting essentially once a day. Yeah. So and I haven't really gotten any I mean it's I mean I don't know. mind you though, my whole thing was me talking. Like it's it's yeah, you're, kind you're, of about me. So I, I mm-hmm. did like the second post of my day mm-hmm. was probably a trending TikTok sound and mm-hmm. I'd try and make some squat video or something. Yeah. You know what I mean? But you made it personable and that's what it Right, that that's the biggest thing. I did that every single day. That was, I mean, it's the same place on the road. It's the same time. Mm-hmm. I'm wearing the same hoodie. It's 
captions look mm-hmm. exactly the same. Yeah. That's all you have to find is like what can you repeat every single day, but Your it's niche. just yeah, it's just the creative part that you're changing every day. So yeah. I just write every day. So that's where I go out. I have my thoughts, what I'm going to say. It's the same exact mm-hmm. video. I'm just saying something different. So it's like yeah. every day you're basically like, what concept should I do? Yeah. And that's the most broad, like, uh, what? Like, I, I, okay, I'll just make a video. Mm-hmm. Like, what is it going to be about? What's the thing? You just need to find a super repeatable thing. That makes sense, though. Yeah. You know, it's like, what do you want people to follow you based on? That, that's the problem I'm having, yeah. Yeah, because if one of those videos where it's whoever saying mm-hmm. a certain quote and it's a bunch of clips of you working out, if that got... 10 million views Mm -hmm. like it wouldn't even do anything for you Mm. you know that's Mm -hmm. kind of the you want it to be attached to my persona instead of attached to like oh the background look cool or oh that's a nice quote said by justin waller or yeah 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 (laughs) you know (laughs) man i found sick take quote you know (laughs) yeah Yeah, right Uh, do do you travel at all Mm. No, I want to more, but I don't really. I just don't have like. It's, it is. Time. It's expensive. Yeah, Although I'll tell you this, there are some really awesome. Pl- like the one thing I've learned too is like, I you don't have to go somewhere. There's so many mm-hmm. weird little towns mm-hmm. in like the, yeah. the U.S. is freaking massive. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Like it's insane. Also, yeah. dude, Amtrak like train tickets are oh. cheap. Yeah, they're yeah they're cheap. I just nobody don't... rides a train. Yeah, I've I've never been fond of the idea of traveling on a budget though. Because if yeah. I mean that's true. Look, if I'm gonna go to Africa, I'm doing the dirt bike freaking safari. Uh, oh, I'm doing yeah. like I'm ziplining like, across in whatever. The, in the U- but like stuff, traveling yeah. in the U.S. to like the national parks and stuff, like yeah, that's right, cheap. Right. There's not yeah. really anything like to do mm-hmm. like for that. Yeah. Like I, yeah, it's I. It's yeah. sick. I, I have a friend who's working at Yosemite this summer. I really? do too. Yeah. Let's I have go. a friend. Uh, I have a friend. Uh, no, not at Yosemite. At um, no, at Yosemite. Yeah, I have a friend working at Yosemite. Dang. Yeah. Who is it? Friend Luke. Hmm. Friend Luke. Oh, my friend Eva. Well, maybe not. It might not be Yosemite. Wait, Eva? Is Yosemite in California? Do you know Eva? Is she the one at the gym? Mm-hmm. Is Yosemite oh, the tall in... one? Yeah. Oh, shit, bro. That's crazy. Like, Yosemite's in California, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, wait. It might not be Yosemite. Okay. <laughs> it's in like... I have a friend that's uh, free soloing El Capitan this summer. Really? Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> that's just the, <laughs> the Alex Honnold guy, you know? Yeah. That's yeah. funny. Have you heard about no. this guy? No. Do you know what free soloing is? Mm-mm. Okay. This is actually horrendously scary. So let's look up El Capitan. I was thinking of Yellowstone Park, not Yosemite. Mm. That uh, makes a okay. little more sense. I want to go to Yellowstone. Yellowstone. I want to ride Yosemite a Yosemite is the one, is the Travis oh. Scott one. It's, yep. it's a face, like a mountain face or whatever at Yosemite. So, so that's it. Wow. Okay. That's, oh, that's yeah. it. That's pretty cool. So it's just like free. It's like rock climbing without me. Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. with, I think you can, with nothing. You can that's do insane. it, I think, with stuff, but no, like that's not what that's he did. Look at this, stupid. though. That is, I mean. Bro, it looks so natural, too. Like it's just, Look at this. No, yeah, no. Are we freaking for real? So I'm now trying, let's go back to those people who are just dangerous, right? Mm-hmm. Wh- What's the difference? What? That <laughs> is crazy. Why? This is stuff that is like I wonder so how long it took for him to get to the point where it's like, I'm comfortable with Look at that. Where like in that. California is you said? Are uh-huh. you for real? Dude. Uh-huh. Are you for... Dude. What if he yanks on a rock and just fucking falls and then yeah, he doesn't exactly. have like, <laughs> That makes me sick. Yeah, no, I don't I don't like I won't ever do that. I don't like rock climbing just like mm. yeah, in nature in nature I would hundred percent rock climb something that high with mm. support. Man, I just learn how to I don't fight. even know about that. With dude. support? Mm. So I, I I don't think I, I get very far. I'm not good at rock climbing. I know someone mm. who last week was doing something like this at a no, facility. Man. Like it was a facility, yeah, 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 yeah. and they jumped off the top and no. landed on the mat. The mat wasn't correctly positioned. Broke their legs. And their heels slammed onto the concrete, and they shattered their heels. Both of their heels. <laughs> That's the thing. I will never. You're not gonna catch me free climbing. Oh, it is. Oh, it is so. Well, that, yeah. That, free climbing that, is dangerous. That, that, like uh, if you ha- if I have a support harness. Yeah. Hey. Yeah, I don't know if I'd actually go that high with sport horns, mm, but I would go. Yo, what the fuck is? That I would go. I, I've never done. I've never done <laughs> so, that though. I've never. Bro. I've never rock climbed in nature, and I'm a terrible rock climber, like in indoors. I would be. I would be more likely to. Um, hey, nice. Let's um, go. <laughs> I would be more likely to do 
a cliff jumping into water kind mm-hmm. of thing than I would be to do like really? a, that high oh, of rope. Sure. You, won't, you sure. won't catch me cliff time. No, bro. I mean, not like a you know ninety foot thing, but maybe like a like the the fourth 10, floor. Foot. I always do this. I look over the fourth floor at the gym. And I say, if that was water down there, would I jump off of this thing? That's Dude, that's I scary, bro. That's, that's, a, that, how high that's that is high. a leap. How high is that? <laughs> I mean, it's four stories. I I don't know. Because, like, at 90 feet, Dude, that's at so, 90 feet yeah, that's like 90 if you're landing feet. the wrong way, you break your ribs. You got to wear shoes and yeah, stuff. Like yeah. You, yeah. And then if you wear – and then it, anything above that is, like, you could – So, I, I've always thought, like, can you, like, on your descent, drop something in the water right before you touch no. to break the surface tension? Does that yeah, not work? I've, no, no. People say that, that, that breaking the surface tension works. Bro, you're still fucking – well, yeah, yeah. You're yeah. still freaking do- like. They'll drop you, like a big rock. Big though, boulder. They'll drop a that. big boulder, okay. but like, like, yeah. I mean, if you're freaking flying out of water and you're playing and you're laying in the water, you're fucking. Dude, dead. that's like how when like spaceships enter orbit, mm. and they first get in contact with like our atmosphere, it's like hitting a brick wall because of just the speed and yeah. Well, the uh, in really nice diving facilities, they'll have the pool. They have, like, jets that make the water all, like, choppy and everything mm. when they're trying, like, a new dive. So when they slam, it doesn't hurt as bad. Mm. Yeah. That's okay. interesting. Water, I didn't know that's cool. Like, water physics. That's crazy. Freaking. Dude, water hurts, bro. It does. Oh, my gosh. That's Try- why a tsunami. I don't like man. water. Yeah, I did, like, a double backflip off of this deck one time. And the first time I did it okay. The next time, just, like, psh, I was like. Like so much pain, <laughs> really bad, dude. When you go, oh. when you go out in the ocean, you're just getting rocked by the waves for hours on end. Come on, you can leave a little sore. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Do you guys like that though? Just swimming in the ocean. Mm-hmm. I love it. I like yeah, ocean. I, I will just go out there and I will just. Like, dude, I love yeah, when you hours. get to a sandbar and then the sandbar has more waves. Yeah, mm-hmm. so you get it's like another mm-hmm. boss. I like when it's a little. I mean, Chop. big for here. Th- those are definitely baby yeah. waves. But when they're kind of above your head, you gotta just go right in there. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 waves here like that are big. Yeah. It's like, dude, out like west, yeah. they got freaking. Oh, but also, got actual it's waves. cold as hell there. It too. is. Yeah. yeah. I got a question. Are y'all beach or mountain people? Beach. Beach. Um, beach. I used to be a hundred percent beach. Now I don't care. Mm-hmm. If you're like, you just wanted to be in nature. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Nice. No, I'm like, if someone's like, hey, we're going on a beach trip. I'm like, sick. Hey, we're going on a mountain trip. Sick. I'm not gonna be like. Oh yeah, no, I yeah. wouldn't go to either. But I like. But I I, 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 I don't. Beach. But like, I guess if you were asking me to pick one, I don't even. I'd, I'd probably. Yeah. It's it's impossible. Something about it. Just if if someone's like, hey, you want to go to Boone? I'm like. Really? Oh, really? No, I love no. it. Because <laughs> I don't know, I'd love to go. Mountain hiking is fun. I love that. It Do is. you just not like how desolate it is, or? I I think I don't. There's more like... to see there, but it's not. I feel like it's. I don't know. I don't like the vibe. I don't think. Of just Boone. Maybe of just those types of places. Okay, I know what you're talking about. It's just, it, it makes me uneasy mm. where there's this, I'm not even going to try to explain it. I don't know. I just don't mm. love it. What, what? <laughs> well, then let's go to the beach. Yeah. Let's we'll go to the beach. See, that's mm-hmm. what I'm trying to say. Like, mm-hmm. I feel like we know so many people at the gym at whatever. We should just put on freaking events. Like, let's Bro, do like a beach trip. I have been trying. Yeah, like yeah. a gym. A do... gym beach trip. Now, beach trip. That'd be you sick. Ever go, would you ever go camping? Yeah. Dude, camping is... I have gone fun. camping. You wouldn't go camping? I don't love camping. Camping is... Dude, camp when you get... I out. like glamping. I like a little toilet. Glamping. I like... Oh, yeah. No, I, don't no, like... I wouldn't even say, like... It doesn't even have to be extreme camping. Oh, no. I'm saying, I... like... Oh, okay. Like... Ben's trying to throw us out there with nothing. We just have yeah, to survive. Yeah. See, I did, a, I did a camping thing. It was my... Uh, the first time I went, like, a couple of years ago. Fourth and fourth. we were... It was a... Uh, um, it was a backpacking sort of thing, but we camped two nights, and then we were ju- we were just in the mountains, and so I woke up at four fifty or whatever it was after looking at my phone a thousand times, and then headlamp, phone light, ran up and down maybe a, a hundred yard grass area for like ten minutes to get my mile. Dude, this was in the middle of freaking. No what the heck ever mm-hmm. and i'm looking back and i'm like dude that it was so scary mm-hmm. i it was pitch so black. for my eighth grade graduation uh-huh. we were required to go on outward bound have you ever heard of that no i've it, heard of it, it is they took us to the mountains and made us camp for a week yeah, they just dropped there's no deodorant there's no technology except for like dude that's lands. crazy that's pretty sad i mean yeah. it was insane i had to carry like 
70 to 80 pound jugs of water on my backpack. Mm. I was like, you weren't allowed 13. to bring deodorant? No, no deodorant. My Why? teacher, my professor, no, my teacher, sorry. My teacher was like, oh, you're going to find your natural scent. My natural <laughs> scent is raspberries. Yeah. No, girl, you smell like B.O. Yeah, like, I was going to say, like, my natural scent is I know there's no That's crazy. But that's why whenever I, like, think of camping, I'm kind of like, ugh, because yeah. I went through that. Right. That's fair. As, like, a 13 No, I, when mm-hmm. I think of camping, mm-hmm. I think of when I was in the, I think, the Cub Scouts. It was my dad. You know, I think... S'mores or even S'mores. steaks mm, or steaks. steaks. Okay. Oh, no, the steak, cooking bro. in the woods videos. I love those. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I've seen that God. one yeah. guy. That yeah. dude who's like freaking top chef. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. that's uh, sick. That's, that's, no, that's, that's the, the type of camp. That's, yeah. no, that's, that's what Let's I think. That. I, I think yeah. of that, and then I like my dad would. Yeah, I think of that. And See, this of, dude's climbing the face of this mountain. That dude's at the bottom cooking some cooking bomb, bomb food. Yeah. Like, bro, yeah. Dude, he just sees his body fall. Yeah. <laughs> and then he eats him. Yeah, he, he eats his liver. <laughs> he chops He chops him. <laughs> We're having a rock climber sandwich. Yeah, and he, Oh, Alex like, Hall. I usually have one of these a month, you know. I just see them He bites on it, there's a shoelace. Yeah. Bro goes hunting, he's just watching people free solo. <laughs> <laughs> That's so nuts, bro. Oh, God. Holy crap. But the, the gym uh, beach trip. Gym beach trip. Come I on. will make that yes. happen. Yeah, yeah. That'd be fun. Let's see, go. I, I would, you know what? If you guys plan it in time, i join you guys. Hey. I don't do go it. to the gym. Hey. That's okay. Bye. We're going to make it happen. I'll be there. Let's hey, go, dude. I'll yeah. be there and I'll cook up. Wait, we'll be for everything? Beach. We'll be at the beach. We'll be at the beach. We can have whatever. We could cook, <laughs> we could cook on the bro. beach. Yeah. Dude, no, bonfire on the beach would be... That mm-hmm. is... Oh, that is fun. That yeah. is sick. But I don't know how... You have to, like, get somebody to do mm. it gotta, for you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, bro, we you gotta, like, bring pre- a bunch of games and shit. Like, yeah, um, yeah. Spike ball. Dude, spike ball is so fun, bro. I love spike ball. I'm gonna build sand castles. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Nice. Now, see, cause I told you I was trying to do the run club thing. Yeah. I'd like 30 people in the group me or whatever. Just no one would show up. I'm like, man, what a bunch Except of... Except for... Unfortunately, uh, that's reality. What's his it name is. would show up all the time. Um, it was just my friends. Owen. Owen <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. All Owen. the time. Dude, yeah. it's all right, bro. We're going to start the badminton club. So. Yeah, dude. Best sport in the world. I will join the badminton Let's club. Let's go. Yeah. Hey, we, got, we got three. Dude, I hate that stupid sport. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> yeah, <Ben's laughs> not invited. Yeah, yeah. Nah, right, but... Just wait, bro. <laughs> nah, hey, I'm talking about a, uh, a mediocre college tennis player. Well, hey. club college tennis okay, player. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Bro, you're nice with it. Dude, yeah. Come on. Yeah. Whatever, Maybe bro. audibly. <laughs> Pickleball? World class. Mm. I'm okay at that one. Okay. <laughs> what, what, is, what is, like, your, your tier, you know? Or do you got, like, uh, a rank? Of, like, which... Like, uh, you got, like, bronze, silver, gold, plat, for, diamond. For the way I... When I played tennis? Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude. But was, what tier were you in? I was, like, freaking... Like, there's a UTR scale. Uh-huh. So, like, like, a professional is, like, a 13. Okay. Like, a high school player would be, like, 5 to 9. Okay. I was, like... Or, no. Sorry. More so, like, three to, uh-huh. to nine. It's, like, the best guy in high mm-hmm. school. Like, nine or ten. Maybe ten. Mm-hmm. I was, like, a seven okay. in high school, college. So, okay. I was, like... You were good. No. No, because there were, like... There's guys who were, like... But you were good, though. Like... Like, I can hit a few balls back and forth. Okay. Yeah. You need the balls back and forth. <laughs> yeah. Come on now. Yeah. That, but... Like, pickleball, though. It's, like... Yeah, I'm beating up You're every beating eight year old. Yeah. Yeah, every eight year old, the hell yeah! Eight year old, beating up them goddamn old, dude, kids, man. Uh, that my opponent's gonna be a, like to to make the the age uh-huh. average, like mm-hmm. that'd be an eighty year old woman mm-hmm. and then a eight year old male. I'm freaking pounding that thing dude, right down the throat. Dude. <laughs> 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 I'm that, pounding the balls. Pounding, I'm pounding that. Hell out of those eight year olds and eight year olds. Okay. <laughs> I'm freaking beat up. Bro, beating, led with the eight year olds. I'm beating them up, bro. I'm freaking, oh, I'm freaking hit that crowd out of that ball, oh, man. Dude. See, badminton, we, we don't even play with a ball. It's, no. it's we, a play sh- with, we play with a It's sh- actually much more. Um, You're using the distinguished. Wrong accent, accent, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Art, it is a bit more distinguished. Uh, yeah, yeah. Badminton. I, I, <laughs> what am I can't do that? Is it called a birdie? Wait, wait. It's a shuttle. What shuttle is this? I call it a birdie. Yeah. Yeah. Why, I'm holding it. Why? Okay. It's about You're that right. big. Yeah. Okay. Big ass birdie. Damn. Yeah. Okay. 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 My bad. My bad. <laughs> wait. You didn't. You gotta keep going, bro. Oh, uh. 
<laughs> yeah, <laughs> negative. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, nah, but uh, it is the best sport in the world. And yeah. I, think, um, I think now that we're fully dedicated to the sport, um, what we'll really be able to make make some waves in, yeah. in the community. So, yeah. Yeah. President yeah. VP sure. and sure. yeah. you wait, is there a badminton club? I'm sure there is. At NC State, yeah, mm-hmm. there probably is. Yeah. It's probably everyone that was there today. I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure it's huge. Probably. Yeah. I think there's one. At, yeah, there's, there's probably one a show. It's big. Yeah, it's fun, man. I like it. It's actually yeah, it's so fun. contained. This so high speed. Mm-hmm. You, know? you know, I'd say there's not many things I hate more than badminton. But okay, it's not that bad. <laughs> I can continue. It's not that bad. Okay, so we've got golf. Mm-hmm. We've got pitch perfect. Mm-hmm. We've got gym beach trip. Yep. Mm-hmm. And we've got badminton, badminton. club. Yep. Awesome. Our work, our work is our cut work out for us. Done, bro. Pickleball is uh, the fifth. Dude, oh wait, we said golf, right? You said golf. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I think pickleball is the fifth. Though. Pickleball. Pickleball is fun. I also pickleball. really like pool. I like pool. Dude, I've been like trying pool. to get better at pool. I suck. Yeah. Because of the pool. song Nine Ball by uh, Zach Bryan. I have not heard that. Mm. We'll play it on the beach. You guys like darts? Uh, I love darts. I love darts. Dude, darts, I got darts is, I'm way apartment. better at darts than I am at, at Dude, pool. darts is fun, I'm bro. I'm terrible at pool. Seven? Seven? <laughs> you're, yeah. just, Seven no? you're just keeping count. Oh, uh, 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 Apex croquet? Legends. Croquet? Yeah, that's eight. Like, with the... With the racquetballs or whatever? Yeah, yeah. Or the bocce, mallets. Or bocce whatever. ball. Bocce. Bocce's so funny. It's the most simple thing I ever people like to. They have a bocce yeah, ball, bocce. like, area in my apartment complex. What? Which is pretty, pretty niche. What yeah, was that's... that game we played at, um, at Gumby's? The, which the one? one where you threw, like, the horseshoe thing or whatever? Or the little mat? You know? Washers. Dude, oh, my wa- God. That what? game is freaking Dude, this is, fun, this is the, man. This is Dude. top notch with the seniors uh, in uh, Myrtle Beach. It's very similar to cornhole. It's these platforms about a foot wide by maybe three feet long, and it's uh, it's covered in carpet. And there's three holes. The one that's further away is three points. Mm. The middle one is two. Closest one is one. And you just have uh, washers like this big, like metal washers, and you're just throwing it, sliding mm. it in. They got like some sand on them. They just put them in the sand on the beach, that's and so these fools cool. are oh, out there. Fun. Just tournament dude, style. We, play, we played for like two hours. Oh dude. man, it's freaking. It's fun. Okay. That thing. Yeah. Okay. It's it's pretty fun. But uh, okay, so we got about eight things on the list. Bro, Minecraft server. Too. No, we, come we, on. we can we can you know nine, he doesn't have to nine, join. Nine, it. Minecraft just, server. I edit yeah. this thing, bro. All right, here's You're the, done. <laughs> here's here's the biggest one. You're off the app. I'm gonna get your archives. Fortnite. Yeah. Nope. Oh. Super Smash. Ooh. Super Smash. Are you a, a Mario Kart? Who's your main? I used to be a Kirby main. <laughs> I why, promise, why, why I you, promise you, I don't like spam Gabby. You, you go, you go. <laughs> like Kirby. Maybe a little. Maybe That's... a little. Maybe a little. <laughs> this is absurd. Yeah. Oh, man. Ten, Kirby... thing, ten things on the roster, Okay. Y'all. Ten things on the roster. Yeah. Best episode ever. Super fun. Brennan K. Smith. Yep. Jess Alin. Barton. Just Alin. Ben Schiffman. Oh, Thanks for coming on, guys. Have a great week.